Why are we all being mean to Coney in the pre-stream chat? Why is nobody being nice or standing up for the streamer? You know that I see all of these messages. I see what you're saying. I, I'm watching the chat right now. I want to play Forbidden Games too. It just hasn't worked out. Dude, Sporkle War went long yesterday. It was a long thing. I only wanted to do one round, but they, they kept going. I was like, hell yeah, I'll keep it up. I love Sporkle War. I was having mad fun. We're going to play the Forbidden Games tonight. There's no plan for tonight's stream, okay? We are relaxing. We're chilling. It's not like Tuesday or Wednesday where we had a plan and we had to stick to it. And we had a schedule. Tonight, we're chilling. Tonight's for the gamers. What do I always say? Thursday is for the gamers. And it's also for the claimers, everybody. Hit exclamation point claim in the chat to get your free sub like Omnitoad just did. You're going to see that thing pop up. And all you have to do is just get your code. You're going to see stream elements. Post a code. It's just a bunch of numbers. Just hold on to that until the redemption point in the stream later on today. All right? Coney, what's your opinion on Project L? Lucky for you, chatter, you get to find out with me. I don't have one yet. I have not seen anything about Project L. I've been very busy. <laughs> I haven't looked at Project L at all, but I also have not looked at NASB 2. Um, and we'll talk about that in just a bit. When are you playing Street Fighter again? I don't know. <laughs> I was going to do it tonight, but we have the, we, we're going to play Forbidden Games, which I've wanted to do for a while. And then I have a sponsored segment for The Expanse. Yeah, NASB 2 React. I did not watch NASB 2. <laughs> I did not watch anything about it. I knew that it was coming. Uh, and I actually have some stuff I have to tell you about it, some secret info. But for now, let's just, you know. But I love Nasby too. I can't wait. Do you know anything about it? So, without getting too far into it, I I was uh I am under NDA for Nasby 2. I do not want to I'm not spoiling myself. So, I did not play the game at all. I have not played the game at all. But I did watch it, and it looks good. It looks excellent. But I have not watched the trailer that just came up. I, I, and, you know, I, I'll save it. I'll save it. We're going to talk about it in a second anyway. You said that last time. No, I didn't. <laughs> I said the game looked awful. I said Nickelodeon looked bad when I saw it. And then I played it when I was at... at uh, I think it was Lo Low Tide City or Riptide, and it blew my mind. Because it was good. Zucchini, what's this? I'm not going to add this. <laughs> Stop with the Joel. Why is Joel on every channel? It's in 24,000 channels on Twitch. This is stupid. What is this? I'll add this versus emote. This looks like it could be funny. <laughs> That's fun. What is going on that every stream I get added and gifted tier one subs every stream when I'm not watching? Hey, man, a lot of people know you in here. We got a lot of fans in the chat, and they just want to make sure that you are taken care of. You're a, you're a celebrity around these parts. No Nintendo? I'm out of here. Hey, there might be a little Nintendo later. Come on, stick around. You never know what might happen on the Coney stream. Anything could happen. When is League? Shut up. You said we'd play this soon. I did not say that. I said I might play it. And that might is a strong might. That's a heavy might. Coney, watch the Street Fighter clip. Okay. <laughs> Look at this emo. This is so good. That's really good. I like that a lot. What's this? Yup. Yup. No. <laughs> wait. Wait, what did... What did Blanca-chan do? It just... <laughs> it just... It just ran across the street. It was like a Mortal Kombat cameo. Bro thought he did, his, he did his job. Okay, well. That's funny. K 
cave limb and playing Honda. He would. Oh, he has the same thing I do. See me in the tub? <laughs> I love that one. I picked that on all my characters. That's my favorite title. What do you do when Blanca doesn't have a tail? He has a mane. Wait, does he have a... That's not a tail. That's Blanca-chan, right? Blanca-chan? Is it Chan or Chan? I'm being too respectful. I grab him by the hair. <laughs> same thing. It's Chan? I can't. <laughs> I don't know which one you're doing. That's the power of the written word. So we got a few things to talk about. It's going to be a fun night. Hold on. I got to... I gotta tweak this out. Dude, I tried to uninstall Valorant from my computer today. Have you guys ever tried to do that? Oh my god. Riot hates it when you do that. It, like, bricked my PC. It's bad. It said that Valorant took up three terabytes on my computer. Where? <laughs> Literally, where? It's ridiculous. Okay, hold on. I gotta, I gotta find the right picture for this. Yeah, it said I have four terabytes of data. My hard drive is like one. <laughs> Where the hell are they getting this? Riot zip bomb. All right, hold on. I gotta get the, I gotta get the picture for the tweet. Do they even have, like, a render shot with everything? I guess not. With the characters and everything? No. Have you thought of playing Amori? No. Do you know where you are? <laughs> I guess that's not fair, because I, I liked Lisa. I, I, I did enjoy Lisa, but I don't think those games are similar, are they? Are you going to grind Nasby 2 like last time? If it's fun, yeah. If it's fun, I'll do it. Okay. Uh... Sorry. What's the right em what's the yelling emoji? Shouting? Yelling? You get, uh talking? I can't find it. Found it. Speaking head. Love that. Excellent. Perfect. Sorry, I'm making the tweet. Okay. Have you seen anything on Nasby 2 apart from the announcement? Yes. So I, <laughs> I, I was, I had privileged information. Um, I have seen more of the game, and I'm under NDA, so I'm not gonna leak anything. I do have secrets. I'll tell you. I can't tell you secrets, but I'll tell you some stuff. That's not secrets. I don't know if you guys remember, but there were, like, leaks or something. It was like, oh, this got leaked, and it was like a data mine. It was like, NASB2 got got leaked or something in the data mine. And I had so many people at me, and they were like, talk about this, talk about this. And I was like, I, I can't. <laughs> My ass had to pretend like I didn't see it. No, I, I can't. I do. What game? What do you mean? But now they've announced it. And now finally, finally... I can acknowledge it, and oh my god, uh, okay, okay, I have not watched the trailer yet though, but I have seen gameplay, um, I have not played the game, but, and I'm gonna do my best not to leak anything, so I don't get in trouble, because I did, <laughs> I'm under contract, okay, this is very important. What are the left and right directions? Do we not have people left or people right? I think people right is just... No, he doesn't look right, does he? How long have you known? Two months, maybe? I think something like that. A little bit. 
Sorry to Smash Bros, but apparently Cosmos is meaning solo inkling now. Good. Good? It will not last long. I am so glad that he's back on that bullshit because I love watching Inkling. One of my favorite characters to watch. That character is god-awful and he will not stick on it long. Light is a bad friend. And you're a bad viewer if you can't afford four ninety nine a month. Guys, the ads are coming in and they're coming in strong. Stop the ad hordes from invading your eyeballs. In only 20 seconds, you're going to get some ads. So if you subscribe with a Tier 1 or a Twitch Prime, you won't get any ads. Go ahead and pop it right now. Otherwise, your mind is going to be infected by marketers and advertisers and copywriters and all that other bullshit. Go ahead and drop it right now. See you soon. Hey, hold on. Oh my god. So so we've been playing music to uh to help Juliet sleep through the night. That shit is loud. I don't think you guys can hear it. <laughs> but that shit is loud, dude. Oh, do I have simply a co Oh, my bad. Whoops. Dude, streaming is so hard. An investment into a Kony sub is an investment for my brain. So true. See, your brain won't be corrupted by ads and, and uh, activations and all that bullshit. Instead, it's just me. It's straight into your brain all the time. Into your in ear holes and into the folds of your brain. And I'm going to snuggle in there very carefully. And I'll, I'll try not to make too much of a mess. I'll take care of you. <laughs> What's the trumpets? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Oh, hold on. I had the wrong... <laughs> Wait. I Can you do that again? It didn't work. <laughs> I forgot to add it on this one. Do it again. <laughs> it's only 200k. Oh. There you go. <laughs> That's the trumpet. I don't know if you saw, but there are two of them. New <laughs> age The trumpet! Yeah, this is the trumpet. That's a lot of Kony coins for the trumpet. Yeah, you can't just pop that all the time. I wouldn't be able to stream. You guys would piss me off. <laughs> I'd be trying to do a YouTube thing. <laughs> the trumpet! Yeah, it is. <laughs> trumpet! Trumpet, yeah. <laughs> there are two trumpets. That's the second one, and that's the first one. <laughs> yeah, see? And <laughs> there's supposed to be more of a delay on them. Um, the I, don't think, I don't think it's, it's not supposed to be going off that fast. But uh, I don't know why you're saying... I don't know why you're saying it's a scam, because I don't make any money from this. This is just... This is channel points. <laughs> This is just going to crash the economy. Yeah. <laughs> the trumpet. Okay. Channel points are point zero 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 one of a penny. Come on. Well, you do get more of them if you subscribe. Tier 1 gets double, bro. How are you guys not all jumping on that? Double channel points for only $25 a month. Real salty betters would hop right on that. Kony, are you allowed to talk about who you hope is in the game or anything like that since the NBA? Uh, I, I don't know what I'm allowed to say. There are a lot of characters that I know about in the game. That you don't. <laughs> a lot. So I don't... I don't think I could talk about who I want in the game. He's under NDA but didn't read it. There are a lot of characters in the game. I'll say that, okay? <laughs> That's all. That's it. I, Dude, it's, it's great. It looks amazing. I love this. How about you stop risking leaking anything? But it's fun! 
It'd be really funny if Cody made videos predicting the characters in SB2, and I got all of them right. I leaked all of them. I bet it's this guy. I bet it's that guy. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you anything. I'm not going to tell you. Except what we see in the trailer. I have not watched the trailer yet. I wanted to keep it fresh. I also have not played the game. I, because I wanted to keep it fresh. The feeling and everything. So... <laughs> I'm not telling you, I'm not telling you anything about it. But let's find out more on our own, okay? I'm actually excited to look at this. <laughs> Fellas, Peak is back on the menu! Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2 has just been announced today. Finally! The long wait is over. We've been waiting years for this game. The streets have wanted a new NASP. Stop trumpeting. Stop trumpeting. No trumpets. I'm trying to talk. We have been waiting years for a new Nickelodeon game, and finally the prayers have been <laughs> I got to turn that shit off. I can't do <laughs> Or make it more expensive. Finally, our prayers have been answered. And look at the character lineup right here. I think it's mostly characters that you already know about. As you, <laughs> I thought, thought two hundred thousand points was a lot. I didn't think people would just do it like that. I thought two hundred thousand would be uh, a, a lot of points, but everybody's trumpeting. <laughs> it is a lot, apparently not. Coney, I have two point seven million. Oh. I, I gotta make it like 500k. I was gonna make it 500k, but I was like, okay. Ruin the intro? I don't think it's going on YouTube anyway. But I'm trying to express to you how big this is. It's a huge deal. Nickelodeon is finally back with all of your favorite characters like SpongeBob and Zim and Reptar and Garfield. And who's this? A new character? What's Squidward doing there? Squidward is a character. I tried to do that like Squidward is a giggling. <laughs> Like this thing. I hope this is his taunt. I hope this is in the game. Squidward is a giggling. What's funny, Squidward? <laughs> I, I love that. I don't know why that's funny to me. He is a giggling. We already saw his taunt. Oh, I haven't seen it. So I have not watched the trailer yet. I'm going to watch it for the first time with all of you. Uh, let's let's go ahead and, and tune in together, shall we? I funny Brazil that sometimes you nail it. The Brazilians got the funniest jokes. That's why they have their own laugh. Why does Brazil do the way? Wait, is that? No. I don't know if that's real. That might just be a meme. You do realize all of us have stockpiled points due to the fact there's nothing to spend it on. That's not even true. Have you seen how many E high fives have come in? I've seen a billion E-high fives. I've seen a few people move in. The, people spend that shit. They do. And I have a new house to move into. You guys are crazy for not doing that. <laughs> That's not in the game. That's not in the game. <laughs> I did see this. I, st I turned it off here, so I didn't spoil it. <laughs> What is this move set even gonna be? <laughs> okay, that might have been in the game. That actually might have been in. I, for all I know, Thaddeus put that shit in. That was too well timed. Okay, so I don't know. I don't know about the song. The song feels a little uh discordant. What map is this? This is probably some Avatar shit, right? Wait, are these skins? Or is he like K. Rule? Anything's better than Get Ready? Oh yeah, I forgot about that first Nickelodeon. The, the Get Ready, oh, 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 Get Ready. I don't know if it's a skin or if it's like a K. Rule thing. No, it's probably a it's a skin because he would put it on quicker. Oh, Flying Dutchman is here. Wait, this was in the last one, but Flying was the Flying Dutchman even on the stage? I don't remember. 
I did not play Rocco at all, so that's all brand new to me. Okay, it's a skip. Was Jenny in the real game? Was Jenny in the normal game? She was? Okay, I thought so, but... Somebody said nerfed Aang there? Oh! Ah, okay. We're making the real changes. I like that. No more staff. Use that water. Thank God for that. That's it. Here it comes. I guess that's Jenny. I don't know. Here it comes. So that's Donatello. Who was not in the last game. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of cool. Why is Nigel punching people now? He used to have animal moves. Now he's just fucking punching a child? Did he box on the show? <laughs> is this his forward smash? Jesus. Boom, boom. That wasn't st the Stimpy move, was it? That wasn't the Stimpy move. Well? It looks like he threw him down. Yeah, that's the Stimpy. But it's like short. I liked when that shit went half the stage. That shit was busted. Thank God, finally. We were waiting. It looks so good. That's one of the things I, I, I can say. I, I got... I, I have seen the beta. It looks so fucking good. Like, I don't know if this video does it justice. It looks fantastic. Seeing this shit in 144 is unbelievable. It's so good, dude. It looks slower. I've seen a little bit of the gameplay, and it doesn't look as, uh, uh, how do you say, um, cocained? <laughs> it's not cracked out, which is different. Silly. Oh, they brought back the breakfast level. Thank God, dude. The, the breakfast level is one of the great tragedies. Honestly, of of the last Nickelodeon game, because nobody ever did the casual stages. This stage was so fucking cool. Is TMNT the Fire Emblem of this game? I think so. That'd be a fair assessment. That's kind of how I felt before. Wait, does Nigel have a bunch of jumps? Did they actually turn him into Jigglypuff? Oh my god, he is. Why is he flying so much? That's not an item, right? Nigel has three jumps. What? <laughs> they actually made him Jigglypuff. Because before, people were like, Nigel kind of feels like Jigglypuff. Because he has the rest, and he feel he has the big drift or whatever. I didn't, I didn't know they would give him multiple jumps, though. I guess like a bird, right? That's the deal. <laughs> I love the Rugrats ball being an item. But I don't know if... I don't... I don't think they're going to put Rugrats characters in the game. Those are babies. I think we made this joke before. I'm not... Bad idea. Oh, Reptar's in. That's probably the closest, yeah. See, I don't... This will be a night we shan't forget. I don't care about this kid. I don't know why people are... Po I don't get it. I was too old for this show. I didn't actually watch it. If they put Dexter in this shit, bro, yo. He's just shitty Dexter to me. I was a Dexter guy, not a Jimmy guy. That's Cartoon Network? Yeah, that's what would make it crazy. Dexter in this game would be like Cloud showing up. <laughs> Could you imagine? That's like Sonic in Brawl. It's a, what? That's what I want. That'd be so much better than this little geek, right? You already had Hugh in the last one. Coney the NDA. You think I'm leaking Dexter? Stop! How did you get it would be kind of cool though, right? Wouldn't that be cool? <laughs> My lab anyway. What? <laughs> what? Squidward is a bathing. Is that his intro? That's probably his intro, right? That's like how he comes in. Okay. 
Bath taunt, you think? Oh, there's April with the black skin. That's nice. The, the black jumpsuit. Wait. Oh, I like that. Wait, what was the up air before? Stepping on the beach. That's what it is. He has a new up air. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to miss some of the, the, the janky hitboxes. I really will. It was the karate up chop. Oh, that was the up strong. You're right. I'm getting the up light and the up strong mix up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the announcer's back. Whoa. <laughs> That's gotta hurt. I love the announcer so much. That guy was so funny. What was that? What is Patrick doing here? Slime cancel? <laughs> is it a slime thing? Roman cancel? Because I know Rushdown Revolt has this kind of stuff where you can cancel your end lag um, with a move. And I don't really like it because it makes the game high APM and I, I don't like hitting buttons. But... Cool, cool. I don't I don't know if I'm feeling the song, but I'm all in, man. I'm all in. Well, I'm mostly in. What's the So I was wondering what the pricing is on this. Cause it said pre order. And I'm like, hmm. What are we asking for? It's fifty? Ooh, that's kind of steep. I mean, I'm okay with it. But I think that's risky considering last time. Because I know a lot of people felt burned. I think it's fine and worth it. Because I've read that they remade a lot of the game. And I will say, from looking at the game, you can tell. It looks fantastic. But I could see people being upset. Yeah, I I, I, I might be getting a free copy regardless. And I'm not saying that because, like, I'm, I'm so important. I'm not even trying to pressure. I'm just saying my, you know, I'm probably going to get a copy uh, to cover it. But I do think the 50 is going to stop a lot of people from getting it at least right away. Right? Not right away. I think it's fine, but... And there was a Polygon interview that where they talked about, like, what they added. And I haven't seen... Again, I haven't seen any of this. All I know from having the beta uh, and, and from seeing the game and just watching it and not playing it at all is that it looks great. But other than that, I don't know anything else. And I know the characters. I know some of the characters. But $50 is probably a Nick decision. Yeah, probably. Nick or the publisher. Again, I think it's fine, but I do think they're going to have to earn back... Not the goodwill. They're going to have to earn that. Right? Um... Is there DLC? Like have they said, I guess they're gonna say that. But Nasby one sold insane numbers. Wait, really? Did it? Season pass, twenty five dollar DLC. Ooh, yeah, they're gonna be under a watchful eye. I mean, if it sold really well, then who gives a shit, right? Uh, if it did great, then it did great. Not insane, but it sold well. Great. Listen, I believe in this game. I, I was, you guys saw me. I was a big ass hater on this game before it came out. I thought it did not look great. I thought it would be very funny. And I thought it would be good because it had ludosity behind it. And they know what they're doing. And I, I really trust those guys. But I thought it looked ugly. And I was like, ah, I don't know. And then it came out and I fucking loved it. And I was like, this is one of the most fun games I've ever played. So I'll be honest with you. To be fair, it still doesn't look great. I disagree. I think it looks fantastic. And again, I, 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 I've seen the game outside of just this. I think it looks great. But that's just me. 
Ludosity, more like Lou Bega. Give me the trumpets. No more trumpets. Also, I found this out the other day. Did you guys know that Lou Bega isn't even his real name, and he's not even, uh, he he's he's German. He's not like I assumed he'd be like Cuban because he does mambo. He's ger the trumpet. he's German. And stop trumpeting. He's German, and his middle name is Lou Bega. Did you know that? <laughs> That's his middle name, Lou Bega. Yeah. Which is a very clever misdirection. He knew what his ass was doing. The trumpet. <laughs> Bro was born in Munich. And he got away with it. Nobody knew. Nobody had any idea. So that's Lou Bega. <laughs> also, he was mad young. Like, when he made Mambo number 5, he was only 24. Jesus Christ. Isn't that crazy? He got in and out before social media. Yeah, I, he was... This guy was before his time. Okay, let's read a little bit about the game and what they've done to it. I'm curious. Hit it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the beloved character of SpongeBob the, the, the interview. Can you talk about what's new here from a core gameplay perspective? Difficult question to answer because it's an entirely new game. Changed almost every aspect in small to big ways. Hope they come as a good surprise. It, you, I, you, you can tell based on seeing it. It looks brand new to me. When I saw it in action. It looks great. We've completely redone how movement works by changing to analog compared to digital. That's cool. Oh, that means I gotta add a walk animation for every character. <laughs> or don't. Or just slow down the run animation. Which actually would be really funny. Analog fucking whack? Wait, really? You don't like analog? Analog means that they can do fast falling. Because remember, they, they couldn't... Last time they couldn't do fast fall in the air because down is down, right? We've also added more options like horizontal attacks, defensive rolls, and dodges. Oh, I guess they didn't have rolls, did they? They just had shield. Yeah. I don't know what horizontal attacks mean. Zzz. Added something that's not common to platform fighters, a meter mechanic, more in-depth system. That's probably the slime. Slime cancel, yeah. Modify attacks, do ultimates? Ultimates? That's probably like a level three, right? This song is fun. Forward airs and back airs? Did the last game not have forward airs and back airs? It did, right? No back airs, no. Side air, oh yeah. Side air. Yeah, right. God, I gotta remember how it played. Finally, something stands out is the character design put a lot of effort into making each character feel unique. <laughs> that means the character, no character. In Nickelodeon 1, it felt like six different characters had a killing jab where they just, ugh. <laughs> Helga, my beloved. Those jabs were so funny. I guess every character had the same up tilt. It was like up tilt to up air over and over and over. It was pretty down air, up air, yeah, yeah, yeah. It felt very, uh, a lot of the characters felt kind of samey in a lot of ways. No way they make each turtle distinct. Uh, I don't know how you differentiate them that much, but then again, I said that for Michelangelo and Leonardo. So, you know, they already did that. Turtles all use different weapons? Yeah, but like, I don't know. It's short weapon or long weapon, right? Any favorite supers you could share just as a taste of what's to come? All the ultimate attacks are really cool. I love Jimmy's and April's. My favorite is him. Okay. <laughs> I hope everybody looks at the move of their favorite characters and says, Wow, that's cool. <laughs> Me too. I hope that too. What was your impression of selecting the roster? One of the hardest decisions we made. A lot of thought came into it. We looked at the reaction on the roster. The first game, more requested characters. What can you achieve with the vast list of amazing Nick characters? Net Nick input as well. I wonder... 
Like, the last game had mostly old characters, right? It felt like there weren't that many new characters until the DLC, and then they added, like, XJ9, who isn't even that new, but... Yeah, it was a lot of old shit. Um, Nick barely has new characters. I guess so. They just had Loud House stuff, right? That was the new, th the new characters and whatever. But... Old and, like, no obscure ones. What obscure Nickelodeon character would you pick, though? I don't... What obscure Nicktoons are... Like, Barnyard? What would you... <laughs> Like, you, you can't go too obscure, right? Doug? <laughs> Doug doesn't fight. Well, I guess a lot of the characters don't fight. I guess that's a dumb argument to make. If I was going to add a Doug character, I would have Roger. And just have him be a complete dick. Or Mr. Dink. <laughs> and he beats you with all of his gadgets. Skeeter? No, Skeeter would be like an item or an assist trophy. Stick Stickly would be fantastic. I would love that. That would be great. Surprises. The funny thing is, from all the list of possible characters the fans are making, none of we've seen have guessed completely right. Wait a bit and you'll know. What's your approach to implementing VO? Is it all original? It's recorded exclusively for the game. After the character is designed, animated, and integrated, we write down the script for every character. That's great. That's very good. So, the prevailing sentiment around Nickelodeon 1, my understanding is, and, and this wasn't ever, like, I didn't hear this from anybody that worked on the game, it's just sort of what got passed around, is that Nickelodeon didn't really give the devs the time or the budget to be able to make something great. They gave them, you know, something. They gave them something to put out the game, and they thought it'd be like a fine kids game, you know, it'd be fine. They put out something that a lot of people were interested in. And I think Nickelodeon is now like, oh shit, there's like, there's an audience for this. And honestly, it's, it's... I don't know, man. People are getting closer, right? Like, between Nickelodeon and Multiverses and all these other games, like, people are getting closer to nailing it and somebody's gonna do it. And I think if somebody just goes whole hog, I don't know, man. Rivals 2, I love Rivals 2. That too. Nasby 2 and Rivals are getting there? I hope so. I really do. Because I think that there's so much room in this space for unique ideas and cool shit, right? So, we'll see. And I hope that Nickelodeon gives them the actual tools they need to be like, here, make a good-ass game. I'm just glad we're trying supers again. I think it's an interesting idea. I, I think it's hard to implement, because then you just end up making PlayStation All-Star. <laughs> but uh, there's probably a middle ground. Yeah, uh, there's got to be something. Script includes all moves, general feelings, responses, reactions, campaign. It's campaign. They did say campaign. What does that look like? Try to use lines for the shows or lines that we think that character should could say. Good on them for getting the voice actors in. I always assumed that would be very difficult to do, but maybe not. I thought that would be, like, impossible. I don't know why I thought that. You could just repurpose show dialogue. It would sound weird and stilted, but still, right? Can you talk about the roguelike ele... <laughs> the what? <laughs> what, do what are you talking about? The what-like elements? Uh, anything you can compare it to? I don't think we can directly compare it to anything that's... Oh, it's Hades. It's gonna be Hades. At least not that I know of. Of course, if you're familiar with Roguelike, you'll understand right away how the campaign works. We made it quite a few adaptations so we could work with the platform fighter. Okay, my guess... That journalist does not know what Roguelike means. My guess, okay, I think it is... Um, I gotta change this song. This is driving me fucking insane. <laughs> that song is actually... It's killing my train of thought. Um... I feel like it's probably something where you play the level, or you play the games, and after, like, every three matches or two matches, you get, like... I bet you get something like, get a third jump. You get to pick. 
Do you want a third jump? Do you want to do more aerial damage? Do you want another stock? Like, you get to pick, you know, as you go. I don't want to spoil too much. We have a main storyline, and you start with SpongeBob as you progress. You unlock characters. But oh, shit! Never mind. That shit is subspace. Each character has his or her unique storylines. The structure is the same on roguelike games. Progress through a series of battles. If you lose, you keep some of your progress. Use it to further your progress. Oh. Ah. So they're going to be... You're going to, like, add damage and shit. Okay, we're unlocking shit over time. Honestly, I think that's cool. That sounds sick. Coney, legitimate question. What makes you feel that this won't be another multiverses and fall off hard after a month? There's nothing to think or not think that. All we have is hope. <laughs> what gives me hope is that Nickelodeon 1 was genuinely something very special. The gameplay was fantastic. It was definitely rough around the edges, but there was so much love and passion, and you could feel it. People loved that game. What held it back was the netcode, and obviously, I don't know how it was for, like, the average person to look at. Um, I, I don't know how appealing it was for people outside of, like, the Smash sense, you know? And it was also expensive, right? Like, 50 bucks for that game was kind of crazy. No voice acting, people didn't like, all that stuff. Um, but there's something very special in there. And I think that people who, who play a lot of these games could see it. Like, the potential is in there. So, what will make it succeed or not succeed? I don't know. I don't... Because, uh, to me, it was a, it was a great game. But... It just has to have that mass appeal. Luck? I don't know if it's luck. I mean, part of it's luck, but... Is the closest we got to a legal PM, which is the Holy Grail. Kind of, yeah. Whoever cracks that code and gives us legal PM, whether it's through licensed IP or brand new characters, is going to be a fucking millionaire. <laughs> if you want a fake PM, try Rushdown Revolt. No, it's not the same. I played Rushdown Revolt. I, it's not for me. I love PM. I do not like Rushdown Revolt. That's just for me. Coney wants icons back. Kinda. <laughs> I don't... I, I... Listen, apparently this game was somewhat successful outside of the realm of just like, you know, platform fighter or whatever. Uh, hopefully they can do that again. But we'll see. Rushdown has a lot of depth, and it's amazing. I'm not taking shots at Rushdown. If people like Rushdown, that's great. I just, I'm not into it, because it's high APM stuff. It's like, I, I'm not into it. PM was right place, right time. Kind of, yeah. That's the other thing, is a lot of it is luck. PM hit at the perfect time in between games where people were starving for something, and it nailed the execution. So, like, yes... A big part of it is the hunger has to be there. But what do we have to look forward to in 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 Platform Fighter, right? Multiverse is it isn't until January, and I think a lot of people feel burned on that. Um Smash itself is probably a lot of people are pretty cynical about that. Because it was 10 years be between Pikmin games. It's over 10 years between Mario Kart games. Are we getting another Smash? I don't know. Something's got to fill that void. And there's Nickelodeon and there's Rivals 2. There's a lot of great games. So there's something maybe. HDR is popping off in my city. That's the thing. HDR is pretty popular in some places. But I don't think it'll ever like, like, like that chatter said. I think it's right place, right time for PM for a lot of it. There's always melee. I, I, I don't. It's it is a very hard sell to get people into melee. At least the average person. Melee is a very particular brain composition to get into. It's very fun to watch, but getting people into melee, the average person, is very difficult. HDR is mid and getting worse. I've never played it. I play my ass played the shit out of a. Uh, 64 remix though. That joint was fun. 
That's gotta be our game, actually. That's our thing. I've, I've, from what I hear, Duck Hunt is turning a lot of people off HDR. I think those characters might be the worst thing about it, because I keep seeing people complain about HDR characters. I'm like, I don't want to see Cloud and Duck Hunt and some of the other characters are apparently got all, like, like killing the game. Not this again. <laughs> Turn that shit off. <laughs> that song is... I can't hear it anymore. It's too much. Okay, we have a main storyline you to be SpongeBob. So it's subspace. That's great. I love that. Maybe there will be interaction between characters. <laughs> Do you guys remember the story mode in NASB 1? Where uh, I think Toph says, I love to fight. Isn't that it? They had like... They, they had like text lines... But they made no sense. There was a story mode. It was arcade mode. And they had like, I love earth. Yeah, it was like, I love earth bending. I love being an avatar. <laughs> it was extremely funny. She likes to fight. Okay, that's it. It was very, and it was like clearly from the game. And I, you could tell the people that made the game were like, oh my God, what are we going to do here? Whatever. Just take a line from the show. Make it funny. It was great. It was just line, yeah, it was lines from the show. It felt like a mandate, yeah. What is this emote? This better be good if your cat jumping for me to look at it. No, I don't like that. That's going to encourage trumpets. Ban that guy. I've had enough trumpets for one night. I shouldn't have even added that. I don't want to spoil it too much. One of the bigger complaints players had about Nasby was the perceived value for the cost. Oh, we're getting into it. Okay. Would you say you've taken that to heart for Nasby 2? Is this the game you plan to support beyond this announced season pass? Absolutely. Put a lot of care into building a much bigger and more polished experience. Stop trumpeting, please. It's a lot of coins and you're going to be broke for salty bet. No more trumpets. It's so loud, is it? I thought I audio mixed it well. <laughs> it's got to be a little loud. Make it one million? Maybe. I'll change it a bit. <laughs> Stop trumpeting, dude! There's so many trumpets! Think of all the coins lost, dude! It's 200k! We put a lot of care into building a much bigger and more polished experience for Nasby 2. And we hope players notice. There are quite a lot of changes and additions. More costumes, better... Oh, they got costumes! They actually... Why is it so quiet now? Okay, you want me to turn it up? It's all the way up. Pop a trumpet right now. Do it. <laughs> Do it! Trumpet. You asked trumpet. for that. You asked for that. That was you. You did that. I didn't pop that. Chat did that. No more trumpets. <laughs> no more trumpets. Trumpet. <laughs> turn this off. I gotta turn the trumpet. <laughs> Guys, I had this idea when I was driving yesterday. I don't know why it wouldn't get out of my head. Sometimes I get these really shitty ideas. I had a meme idea with the weird sailor from Rusty Bucket Bay. You guys know this guy? Hold on. This guy. I had a really stupid meme with it, and I've made it three times and every single time I delete it because I'm like, nobody's going to laugh at this. This is so stupid. <laughs> but I'm not going to... Uh, I'll tell you later, maybe. Don't worry. You're not going to laugh at it. It's stupid. Okay, they built a lot of care into building a bigger, more polished experience. A lot of changes, more costume. So the costume thing, I think, was an issue because, like, didn't they not get... I think they weren't allowed to use costumes right no colors or costumes yeah, yeah yeah i think in nickelodeon one it was like they straight up weren't allowed to do that no recolors either well i mean that kind of makes sense as weird as that is like think about brand identity have you ever seen like red spongebob right <laughs> i feel like you can't that's not... That doesn't happen, right? There was that episode where he had the suds and he was a little faded, right? I don't know. 
Yes, actually. I don't think he's ever been red spongy. Who is that? The sailor joke now? <laughs> I don't Go on, Coney, tell me the sailor joke. I don't even think it's accurate. I don't even think it's a good hold on. It was so it's not even funny, you guys. It's not even a funny If I tell it now, you're not gonna laugh because I don't have the setup. I'll do it later. I'm trying to talk about Nickelodeon. Can we focus? One thing at a time, please. Okay, before I tell the joke. No, stop. Stop going fucking crazy. Guys, stop. I'm going insane. Okay. Now, before I tell the joke, this is very important. Does he make that sound? Does he make that sound, or does he say ahoy? That's the purple guy? Wait, then my meme doesn't work. <laughs> he says ahoy? Uh, d are you sure? <laughs> I have to go down this whole list. Um, dry cough. Different guy? <laughs> it's pissing me off. I'm turning it down again. There's too many trumpets. I should not have turned that on. Is it Sailor? Hoy? Ahoy. I don't think that's on here. Never mind. This is an amazing stream. It's not going well. I don't know why you think that. Look at my fucking channel point. Look at my activity feed. Do you see this? The trumpet, 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 the trumpet, the trumpet, 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 the trumpet, the trumpet, the trumpet, trumpet. It's such a stupid idea. I don't know why I did that. The trumpet. Well, I, I'll tell you later. I thought I thought he said yeah ha ha and that was part of the joke. Trumpet. It was your idea. Shut up. <laughs> Okay, we built a lot of care into that, into building the thing. All right. Please just disable this pit. I got I'm going to make it more expensive. This was a bad idea. I thought 200k would dissuade people from doing it. It didn't work. It was, it was a bad idea. I still have 800k left. You only get four more trumpets. <laughs> okay. I'm going to make it a million. I'm making it a million. Okay. <laughs> I have to do it now. I have to do it right now. I have to do it right now. This was a bad idea. This was very stupid. I'm doing it right now. It's for a million. The trumpet it... <laughs> Stop trumpet. <laughs> okay. Trumpet is one million. And the trumpet is one. Okay, done. We're done. We're done. Lock that in. Is it saved? No more trumpets. Make it full volume now. I'll make it louder now. It's now louder. Okay, there you go. I'm so glad I got the trumpet once. Yeah, I hope you hold on to that memory forever because it's never happening again. This was a stupid idea. Okay. What were some of the bigger lessons lear <laughs> learned in developing the first Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl? Oh, wait. I meant it to go. I, I didn't finish this out. Better animations, better sound, VO at launch, better note code. I, this better be true. This shit pissed me off. It was really bad. Campaign, more gameplay modes, and more. We hope players have fun playing the game and feel like they're getting a great value. Dude, this is so... This is such a weird situation to be in. Because, like, if that shit went off, it... Like, if everything... If this was the first game, right? And it was 50 bucks, it would be ideal. It would be perfect. But... I, did, I, I feel like people are going to be so wary about this. I don't know if people are going to buy into this again. C 
season pass. I don't think there's anything wrong with that on its own, right? It's just... I don't know. This is literally a Street Fighter revision. Yeah. I, I think people are going to be wary, but I do think people might come around if they see it's... I don't know. The market moves so fast. I'm not spending that much on it again, and I'm the target demo. I think the market moves so quickly. Like, people are going to decide immediately, and it's hard to get people interested beyond the first day. Is the game going to have casual fun, or is it just competitive pandering again? Well, I mean, they said that there's a campaign mode. There's all kinds of stuff now, so they're going to add new stuff, but... Um, there's a roguelike campaign mode, which is nice, right? But... A lot of lessons for the first game. Most important one was to have VO at launch, yeah, which we do have this time around. But overall, we learned a lot and tried to apply as much as we could to NASB2 to make it a great game. Down the small gameplay changes, cross-play and online, how we approach second-player content. Players reaction to the first game and the crumble, see all the people hyped about the game. <laughs> yeah. Happy with the reception, all the feedback we got. Oh, this is... Uh, the feedback we got seems very... I don't want to say backhanded. <laughs> A lot of people had a lot of feedback. I will say that. Not all of it was worth reading, but there was quite a bit. How is this not an Overwatch 2 replay? Because... I think because they're actually delivering. Like, Overwatch 2 was like, look at all this stuff we're going to add later. This game is actually delivering on day one. With, like, they're going to have the stuff in it. But it's not free like Overwatch 2 was. <laughs> All of these features should have been in the first game. Uh, maybe. It does feel like the first game is more like a like a beta or a test thing, but I don't know. I love the game enough. I, I would I I think I would as a content creator, I would buy it anyway. But if I was, you know, the average competitive player without a stream, I'd probably be like, uh, eh, I'm gonna wait. Are people poisoned on sequels now because of Overwatch 2 and games as a service? Probably. I think it's hard to sell people on anything now. Any type of video game. There's just so much out. There's so much to play. There's so much that's free. Um, so much that isn't free but gets to be free. Like on the Epic Game Store that comes out, like, you know, every single week. It's hard. Yeah, how do you beat Fortnite? Yeah, Fortnite just got Futurama for some reason. I, which is weird to me. I don't know why Fry is in the game. Nasby 2 on Game Pass might go stupid. Oh, that's true. Wait. That shit go on Game Pass with crossplay? <gasps> oh. Wait. Talk to my boy Philly S. <laughs> that's my boy! I hope so. Oh, this shit too scary. This song sound too mysterious. Turn that shit off. Yeesh. I don't know. I'll be cautiously optimistic. I hope it's good. Nasby 2, no game pass is a skip? I don't know. I hope it's good. Um, I, I, th th I've, I've seen the game. Right, I have I've seen the game in the beta, which I I I've looked at quite a bit. Um, I have not played the game at all, <laughs> but I do like the pace of it. Like it looks a little bit slower and more um, discernible to the average eye. Coney, what secrets can you say? None. I'm not telling you anything. They've got to have another, like, surprise character, though, right? Like, they, they've got to have something up their sleeve, like a Garfield. <laughs> Garfield was fucking... I, although, it wasn't a surprise for me, because I guessed it. If you remember that. I guessed the shit out of that. Well, yeah, and you know. I actually don't. I don't know. I don't know if there's, like, a big surprise character in there. If there is, I, I don't remember it. I looked at this a few months ago, so maybe they added more. Is going to be an anime character? Well, they already have Avatar. <laughs> what are you talking about? You need more? 
guessed? I did guess Garfield. Are you serious? Yes, I guessed Garfield. There's a whole clip with me showing it. It was like months before the game came out. I said that he would be DLC. I guessed that shit immediately. That doesn't count. Yeah, okay. Wait, I'm not clicking on that. Wait, what was... Wait, what is this imager link? Why did I click on that? What is that? Wait, is this leaks? Oh, no. These are just who we've seen. Thank God. <laughs> oh, my God. I clicked on an imager link. I got so mad. Okay, no. These are the people that you have seen and that you know about. Okay? <laughs> Holy shit. I gotta stop clicking on links. Good Lord. Phew. These are all the people you know about. Jimmy and Squidward and these two. Hugh wasn't shown. Coney run. Oh, was he not? Oh, well, maybe he's not in it. I don't know. Maybe. Do we know there are five more characters? I don't know. I don't know what you know or what I know, if I'm being honest. I haven't opened up the, the demo in a long time. I have not opened up the beta. Yeah, Hugh was in Nasby 1, but I don't know if he's still... I just see a link in chat, and I'm like, ooh! <laughs> I love clicking things. It's so fun. It's a shiny, colorful link that I haven't looked at before. I like that. Coney, click this one. This better not be the guy with the... If this is what I think it is, I'm going to be really mad at you. Oh. <laughs> It's the coolest Jimmy Neutron ever. I know I know there was a link that you would send people in the past month that would get people in a lot of trouble. That's the one. <laughs> yeah. Don't don't relax. Enough. Stop. Do not do that. You're gonna get banned. I'm gonna ban you. I'm gonna ban you if you do that, okay? No more of that. <laughs> Stop it now. I hope Nickelodeon 2 is good. I am gonna keep my eye on it. I don't know when it comes out, though. Did they say? Like, does it say on the, the thing? Does it... Fall? Fall is in, like, three months. Fall is what? September, October, November, dude? Pre-order's tomorrow, so I assume we get the date then. Maya's not pre-ordering. Well, that's probably because I'm getting on Steam anyway, but... Nesby 1 came out in October. I mean, it's good for... Dude, look at how that looks. Do you see this screenshot? Do you see how gorgeous this looks on the Flying Dutchman level with the shadows? That looks fantastic. Surely it's being revealed at Evo. I thought the game was going to get revealed at Evo, actually. I did. <laughs> I, I, I thought this was an Evo thing. When I saw this come up at 9 a.m. today, I was like, huh? What? But I do think if this was an Evo, people would probably make fun of it. I think the FGC people would be like, what the fuck is this? I don't know if it's the same audience, but... Yeah, people would laugh at this quite a bit, I think. Dude, I did see this review. So IGN uh, reviewed Twisted Metal... Can you guys guess what the number is? What the fuck? Twisted Metal is a miraculously enjoyable blend of comedy, violence, and thoughtfulness? What do we mean by that? Thoughtfulness? The future of the franchise, baby. Oh, my God. The, the worst part about that is you're right. It's all going to be like this. It's going to be Will Arnett with Anthony Mackie. They're going to they're gonna mocap them in the next game, driving the cars. What do they mean by thoughtfulness? Sweet tooth but woke. I, I, read, the, I read a bit of this uh, review, and it said that, yes, the, the thong song bit was bad, but you can't take any... Yeah, addressing the thong song element in the room regarding the clip that was uh, released a month ago. It was bad. 
Having not watched all of Twisted Metal, I'd be hard-pressed to find any one scene that would stand on its own and represent the series well. It's an all-in affair. This is such copium. This is the most copium I've ever read. Oh, it's just not... It w works in context. It's really funny in context. What do you mean by that? Their own video called it remarkably bad. Yes! And then they gave it an 8. I don't know if Peacock shelled over some money, because Peacock is down like $3 billion. I don't know if you saw that. Peacock is losing money hand over fist. I don't know if they gave IGN a billion to give them an eight. How much is it going to be to get a great score? <laughs> well, IGN starts at seven. It's going to be 500K for every point after that. This is stupid. FNAF will save them? <laughs> it might. And while we're at it, why don't you guys save yourself from some ads? Guys, ads are starting right now, and if you don't want to see them, subscribe with Twitch Prime. But don't worry, I'm going to pop a bounty during the ads, so, you, so you're not going to miss too much. I got another ad to run during the ads. Guys, pop a Twitch Prime if you don't want ads for the rest of the stream, or a tier one for only $4.99. The, the viewer count dropped by 50. Listen, stick around. We got There's a lot more to come, okay? Just stay here. Don't leave. What are you scared about? I'm not watching Twisted Metal. Just stay here. We got some cool stuff tonight. Come on, everybody. <laughs> Stick around. Okay. Now, fellas, we were just talking about Nickelodeon, right? Which is very fitting. Because I have something to show you that's going to blow your minds. Something that you may not have known or heard about. But there's something that's happening... Uh, that is adjacent to Nickelodeon that I would love to tell you all about. This is going to suck. Shut up. <laughs> Why would you say that? Why is that what your, what your first instinct is? Fellas, I have some great news for you. The Turtles are back! That's right, everybody. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles are back in this first look exclusively on the Coney stream. It's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Mutant Mayhem, and Ninja Turtle for audiences. I want to know everything about you. Our daddy is giant rat. You guys know what it's like to be a teen. Honey is the purple one. He's the genius, and he uses a bow staff. Michelangelo is the funny one, who's orange and uses nunchucks. And Raphael is the rebel, and he's red and uses sides. Don't do people. This isn't okay. a quiz. Stop um, studying. So You're enjoying this. Come on. We're all having a good time, and we're all going to enjoy Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem unleashing in theaters August 2nd. Guys, the cast has so many people in it. Look at the cast featurette. Let's just take a look at some of the people in this movie. Seth Rogen is in the movie, and he's actually trying this time. Uh, in, a, in a recent animated movie he was in, he said he was just going to be Seth Rogen. But no, he's actually trying this time. He's a full-on pro producer. Fan. He Gosh, loves this shit. Dude. I'm pretty sure John Cena's in the movie. Uh, and, and a bunch of actual teenagers, which is a big enough deal for them to make it a bullet point on the thing. So that's that's good for them. So check out uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles in theater. Is that Jackie Chan? It is. Jackie Chan and... Uh, her and him <laughs> ice cube as superfly and there he is <laughs> the man himself john cena in the building uh paul rudd ant-man uh i feel like i know her her john carlo esposito Gus Fring himself as Baxter Stockman. That's right, an all-star cast. Is that Hannibal Burris? Maya Rudolph. Yep, every celebrity under the sun. And you gotta be there, too. All that's missing is you. Check out Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles uh, Mutant Mayhem in theaters August 2nd. I went way over the bounty time for that. <laughs> Whoops. That was way too long. Dude, it said that it said it said highlight the relatability of the teenage mutant. I'm too old for this. Why did I get that bounty? What <laughs> do you mean highlight the relatability? Hmm? 
I don't know why they want you to talk during the whole trailer. Oh, they don't. That's a me choice. <laughs> I make that choice. That's what I do. <laughs> they probably hate it. I haven't gotten a call yet, but I bet that this fucking guy again. You can't even hear the trailer. But they do give me, like, it's like a full script, like, this long. And how do I watch the trailer and do that in two minutes? Right? Read the donation out loud. Coney, hold on, I'll let TTS read it. <laughs> Shall we? Coney is like Raffle because he's short, bald, and angry, and I am like Leatherhead because he's big and awesome gore legend. <laughs> That went. I was. I was mad, but then it. It was. It went in a good direction. Okay. All right. Gorilla Chad in the chat. Fine. Leatherhead's dumb though. Leatherhead's stupid. Coney crossing the picket line. What is Ninja Turtles not okay? Is this not? Am I not allowed to? Wait. Is that? Uh oh. <laughs> I. Th I didn't know. Yeah? Oh. Uh. How about a Honkai Star Rail bounty? Would that make it better? <laughs> Would that be okay? I got one of those, too. You guys want to play Honkai? <laughs> I'll do that, too. You are now banned from all future SAG Afro jobs. Hey, that actually might come... I used to do theater. I used to be an actor. That's real, so... Don't make jokes about that. Okay, really quick before we get into Forbidden Games. This is for real, okay? Uh, can anybody link me the Project L info that I need to see? Because I have not seen anything about it. And when I search Project L, I just get a fucking... I get content creators. I played the game. I played the game. I played the game. Is it this? Devs play duos? Don't care about that. Introducing duo play. What's the trailer? Devs play duos, okay. This is the new gameplay? Okay. Hey, Draggle's here. In case you missed it. I heard that a bunch of people got invited and they got to see the game and play it and 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 have fun. And I saw that shot of like everybody in the same room writing down notes and I was so jealous. I'm so sad, dude. I have ten years of experience with League of Legends. Get me in that fucking room. Now I might not know anything about fighting games, particularly anime or or, or tag fighters, but you know I could I could learn, right? You should have been good at fighting games. Maybe I am. I got the diamond. <laughs> I'm a diamond DJ. That's pretty good, right? That's not bad. On DJ. Dude, I'm so sick of these fucking tier lists. Everybody's like, oh, DJ top two, DJ top three, top five. D to who? Hmm? Huh? I see Gaia winning everything. What are you talking about? We just announced duo play for Project L. So Stupid. go watch that video first. Who's the girl in the front? Her name is Ari, and I hate her a lot. This is one of my least favorite characters in the game to fight. Ari hides behind minions and is scared the entire game, but if she hits you with one move, then you die. Duo play for Stupid Project L. So go watch that video first. Here's the debut of a full match played by the dev team. I love the idea of this duo thing, and I can't believe nobody else tried this. I can't believe nobody else has done this yet. I thought they were going to do it. Do you guys remember Guilty Gear uh, Iska? Iska? Is that what it was on the PS2? <laughs> Dragon Ball did it? Did they? I never saw anybody doing 2v2 in Dragon Ball. They have 3v3 in fighters. Really? Dragon Ball did it and nobody played it. Okay, well then what makes this different? Why is this better? On the first team, we have Pat the Flip, a fighting game legend and teacher extraordinaire. Multiverse is forgotten. Carolina, well, it's not the same. A game designer leading the not in a tag line. game, right? On the other team, we have Maxine, a.k.a. Max, and Dan, a.k.a. Dread. How when many characters do they have? Duo, they're collectively known as Maximum Dread. <laughs> Cheer them all on and check it out. Okay. I mean, Orb is always going to be the safer one. Look at all these tryhards with their sticks. Okay. okay. So just Where are the that pad friends? A, a, like a long ass combo. Okay, okay. There's going to be 14 at launch? Dude, that's a lot. Really? All right, good luck. Have fun. <laughs> oh my god, look at Darius. Oh dear lord. Okay. Oh, 
This looks stiff. Oh, that's big damage. Okay. Nice. Oh, there we go. All right. Make a spend. It's fine. Good. Oh. It apparently oh, isn't. Nice. Oh my god. I take it. So uh, I haven't gotten the chance to play it. Look at my health. All right. You gotta stick around a little longer. Okay. Uh, Time for the comeback of the century. <laughs> aggressive hit stun? Yeah, I... Okay, I don't know a lot about these kind of games. Um, it, it looks kind of ugly to me. <laughs> I don't have it. I'm, I'm gonna... I, can, I, can I say something without everybody getting mad? Can I say something without everybody being... Because everybody said it was great and they loved it. I, I don't like the way it looks. It's in beta? Yeah, but I've seen so many people going crazy for this. It's weird to see everybody clowning on Mortal Kombat and everybody else hopiuming for this game. Does that make sense? I think it looks awkward somehow. Yeah. Just do what Hungry Box did. Can I, can I, can, listen, can anybody, no, I would get canceled so fast. People would be so mad at me. You just told us how amazing Nasby looked. Nasby looks fantastic. I don't know. There's something about it that looks stiff to me. And I know it's a beta. They're probably still working on it. That's not, you know, it, it looks weirdly, um, I don't know how to put it. Oh, I like that. I like him just jumping out of the thing. Choppy? That might be the right word. I don't know what's making it look strange to me. But again, I don't play these games, so maybe this is normal for it. Right? I don't have it. It looks like a League fan game instead of an actual Riot game. Kind of, yeah. I think that's my thought. Spider-Verse frame rate? Uh, maybe. I don't... Like, it, it, I'm not... And I'm not trying to be needlessly uh, negative. Really. It just looks weirdly... I'm, I'm gonna save the save. Oh, no. Oh, my. I think taken on their own, like, individually, they all look good. The animations look good. The characters look good. Yeah. But, like, when you time. put them together... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw, I saw. Coney, you are nitpicking and biased. No! He won! Oh, no. Not yeah, again! Oh, okay. All right, get it? Every time? Oh. I don't know. Maybe I am nitpicking and biased. I might be. I like the idea of people tagging in, though. That's cool. Oh, okay. Nice. Oh, no. Nice. I just got it back up. Is that a grab? Probably, yeah. Uh, oh, good stuff. Tagging? I have a hard time following it or knowing what the hell is going on here. Okay, so that was a good thing because that extends it, right? You do this and then he can pull. Pro I wonder if that's blockable. That might be a. 1v1 and 2v2 are separate rank queues. This 1v2 shit scares me. I did read that. I saw that people said that you could do 1v2, so it's one guy against a team of two people, which is kind of neat. Oh, nice. I really hope they change the health bar and meter UI. Looks pretty basic, even for Riot standards. I mean, like, I, I'm I'm being critical, but I feel like those are probably the last things they'll change, right? Like, once you have the, 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 the skeleton and the bones there, they're probably going to make it better, and it's going to look great. This is probably a fantastic start. I think maybe I'm looking at it through the lens of, like, League is a 10-year-old game, and they're putting all of these resources into it. And maybe I'm looking at it from, like, League and Valorant, which were their two big releases. And then if this is their third, I, I was like, oh, it'll look like that. But maybe in trying to be more transparent with the community at large and, you know, trying to show off more as they go along, they're being a little bit more vulnerable with this, which is probably the right way to do it. You're forgetting TFT. No, I'm not. That's not a real game. I played TFT for a month. I hated that fucking game. Okay, you. Coach. Yeah. Oh, no. okay. Riot's trying to take over the world, dude. Oh, Rune Terra. I did forget about Rune Terra. That's so weird, dude. Where are you going? <laughs> She's like, I'm out of here. What is this up here? Burst? Burst, okay. I think that was Burst, right? Is that Burst? Oh. <laughs> Die! Holy shit. Sorry, my assist does extra damage. Took that one. 
Oh. So Darius in the League lore is canonically an executioner that chops off your head. In his ult in League, it doesn't really work like this, but it's supposed to be him literally decapitating you in the game. <laughs> So it's funny to see him front and center of this, because like if it was lore accurate, you're, you, his level three super would just kill you instantly. Oh, oh, oh. He's one of the leaders of Noxus. All right, well he used to be an executioner when I played. Maybe he had a promotion. Nice. Well, I got the. Right, got the <laughs> oh, no. okay. oh, good oh, jump. Draven is the executioner. Wait, is he? I thought Draven was like a gladiator, and the he was like a. Whatever. Oh, excellent. Nice. Coney League lore posting is even sadder to me. You guys want to hear my funniest League story ever? And I know that this is, I know I've told this story before, but I love this one. <laughs> Can I tell you this one? I love this one. Uh, so I, literally no one said yes. No, I, I, a few people said yes. I saw it. So when I played League, right, the two times that I played really seriously... When I played it really seriously, I had two main characters, okay? Uh, Twist of Fate, when I was trying really hard, and I, I got high rank. And then when I came back later, I played Graves mid, right? So I played Twist of Fate and Graves. Those are my two uh, highest whatever characters. And I left for a couple years, all right? I quit the game. And one time I logged in, and it said, hey, you got a new emote. And, they, and, I, and I log in, and I got this. And the game said, yeah, they're gay now. Happy Pride Month. And I was like, what? Because to me, I didn't know that this wasn't like personalized. Like I, I didn't realize this was a lore thing. I thought it was like, hey, we took your two mains and made them gay. They love each other now. You get what I'm saying? Like I thought it was like, I was like, uh, what? Like, it, like a my shop situation. Like, if you, if you liked, like, Volibear and Velkaz, right, they would have been, hey, these two are in love. Happy Pride Month. Like, this was specifically made for me. <laughs> I thought this was personalized. It was a ship for me, right? But no, this was just, in the lore, these two are, are together now. And that's great. That's fine. But it, like, it took my brain a second to register. Because I was like, wait, did they, how did they have the resources for that? It was a few years ago. Not everything is about you, Coney. For that split second, it was, though. For that split second, I thought everybody got a personalized gay emote just for them. Happy June. <laughs> I was like, damn, dude. Riot's got money, money. Alawi and Akali are my power couple. Dude, I, I didn't know what to think. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I had a similar experience of Pac-Man dropping 765 when he wins in Smash, and that's my fucking area code. Pac-Man winking at the screen. <laughs> Doxing you in the game. Holy shit, that's funny. I, I always wonder what it's like for people named John or Dave or something that hear their voice all the time in other media and like their ears, you probably get used to it. You don't, your ears don't perk up anymore, right? You're used to it. When I hear my name sometimes, I'm still like, uh, oh, because it's not that common. It's kind of common, but not that common, but Coney getting 619 is a Pikmin password. Okay, I can spoil that bit now. It's not even a spoiler. I was playing Pikmin, and there is a point where you have to know a number combination. And my combination was 619, like Rey Mysterio. <laughs> and I was like, wait, what? Really? And it turns out that's random. I just got very lucky. It's completely random. <laughs> I, I popped off for it. I was I got the 1-9, and I was cycling through, and I was like, no way. It's And then it was. It was the 6. What's the room? What's the room from The Shining? If you got The Shining code we'll go, on the... We'll go, we'll go. What? Oh, that was my friend's... That was a Discord call. 
Holy shit. I forgot I was in a Discord call. Oh my god. Yeah, when my friends join a Discord call, everybody goes, what's good? What good? What good? And it gets more and more distorted. And I guess nobody's talked for a couple hours. <laughs> Holy shit. That scared the shit out of me. Whoops. <laughs> I was so genuinely concerned. I thought somebody popped, like, a donation alert. And I was like, wait, what was that? Is that a bad TTS? Okay, thank God I've been muted this whole time. Holy shit. Okay. Anyway, I, I, I whatever the room is in The Shining, I think that would be very funny to get in Pikmin 2. <laughs> Somebody in the U.S. has that code, and they're like, why did they reference The Shining? 237, is that it? Okay. <laughs> why is Olimar having... That's weird. <laughs> One guy got 666. Oh, I have nothing to say. Yeah, it's funny. That's funny. Yeah. All right, tag him. Oh. Oh. Yeah, see, I'm not a fighting guy, so I don't know exactly what I'm looking at. You're coming in. Um, but... I just oh. think... I, 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 without being too, be, it's weird that everybody is clowning on Mortal Kombat. Because I think Mortal Kombat doesn't look bad. Right? I think it looks okay. This looks kind of stiff too, right? It feels really generic. Kind of, yeah. Mortal Kombat is coming out in September. <laughs> That's true. This game has no release date. They could take another five years to come out. That's a good point. That's a very good point. Yes. They could take another ten years for this game. That's accurate. Yes. You're right. Yeah. This game is at least two years out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, again, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just telling you my thoughts on the game. Riot has infinite money, right? They'll have time, so... Fighting games now need style and attitude like Street Fighter stand out. I wonder how much, though, League on its own, because they built up so much lore and shit with the characters, and clearly Arcane was a hit, which is why, like, Echo's in the game. I'm sure they're going to add Jace, right? Like, characters from Arcane. Um, Powder, Bat Chest. Max played it and had a hella imp uh, positive impression for what it's worth. I don't know where hella came from. You didn't say that, but I threw that in there. Um, that's good. So did Say Jam. If people like it, then that's great. To me, I think it's kind of ugly, and I, I'm not seeing the appeal just yet. But it's better to lock down the gameplay and then do all the other shit later. So even Leffen likes it. Well, Leffen's gonna I think Leffen will like it until it comes out. <laughs> and I don't even think that's from an angle of like Leffen like, you know, shilling for the money. I think it's more Leffen enjoys it. But when it starts getting annoying and competitive, then it isn't fun anymore, you know? Then it'll be annoying when money's on the line. That's the vibe that I get. The idea of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I can't blame him because I'm kind of the same. I get it. <laughs> I mean, there was... The, the fucking Mute Ace made a tweet today that was... Hold on, let me find this Mute Ace. Because this shit got me thinking. My ass was a-thinking. Are competitive games supposed to be fun at top level? Genuine question. I don't know. I think at top level, the fun comes from winning, and that's it. I think they, they it's hard to make a game consistently fun all the way through. It's a good question, right? I think no matter what, always, you know, people will stick with it and love the game. But let's say after top... And not like Honeymoon Phase, like right now in Street Fighter VI, right? Like, let's say two years into a game or three years into a game, uh, is it still fun at the very top level? Or is it just if you win? Because I think it comes from winning at that point. But that's just me. It's harder to see your improvement at top level. So you think fun comes from improving and like micro um, sort of um, improvements. Iteration. Eventually at the point you get sick of it, right? Uh, I don't know. 
I don't know if you getting sick of it is because of the game or because you're putting your whole life into it. Like, maybe the game is still fine, but when you attach your, your personal worth and the ability to eat tomorrow onto a video game, you're going to have a lot more attachment to it, right? It's going to be a little different. You get sick when you stagnate? Yeah. Like when you plateau a little bit? Or is this just the result of Minecraft, Steve? Uh... I mean, everybody says that it's a it's a Fighter Pass 2 thing. Um, I don't know if that's true. I think people would, will complain about anything, but I do think that Fighter Pass 2 changed the game in a way that was ultimately probably negative. Mutase is very good against Steve, but even still, I mean, like that, it's kind of a broader question. But Fighter Pass 2 is just the boogeyman? Yeah, maybe. What is that X on Twitter? Oh, that's that's Twitter now. It's so stupid, man. <laughs> uh, the guy that runs Twitter is weirdly hyper fixated on this letter, and that's what he's doing now. I think he's trying to tank it. I, you know, I I don't I don't I don't, I haven't read anything about this. I'm sure it's not even a particularly uh, hot take or anything. I'm sure somebody else has said this too, but I think he just doesn't care if it dies. Might want it to die. Who gives a shit, right? That's giving him too much credit. <laughs> I mean, that might be true, too. Like, there's any thought behind it at all. I don't know. That guy's fucking weird. You can tell. You just kind of, like... Like, I, I, I think I think humans could just kind of sense it through the screen, right? That guy, Something's up with that guy. <laughs> it's weird. <laughs> you know, actually, hold on. I saw this tweet too. This X. And I never really realized this before, but it's a hungry box tweet. Hmm. Look at that. Huh. <laughs> Now, I wonder why I never noticed this. And it's because in League, he's a lot more, like, muted. Like, his model isn't quite... It doesn't pop as much, right? This is how he looks in the game. He has on, like, an apron. Because he's a tinker or whatever. It's hard to see details, yeah. Guys, don't... Ew. Guys, you never see him this close in the game. <laughs> League, you see him from, like, a bird's eye view down. Stop laughing. It's not funny. It, it looks fine, guys. This looks fine. <laughs> League is so bad. Guys, it's a good game. It's the most played game in the world. <laughs> Running defense for Riot. Show Zillion model. Wait, how does that look? <laughs> I'm actually curious. <laughs> the cops act like metal deer solid and slick he's an old ass bitch he is so old oh my god does he have the pizza feet no he doesn't have the pizza feet anymore this is a very old character not just oh i'm very funny lol because he's an old man but he's a very old thing i don't know why he has a big clock on his back pizza feet you don't you haven't seen pizza feet hold on So the old models in League of Legends used to have... They all had pizza feet. They looked like this. They have feet that's like slices of pizza. That's what everybody called it. He had pizza feet. That's old Twisted Fate. Uh, Pantheon had it too. Let me see. Oh my god! <laughs> Maybe not Pantheon. I guess he had his tootsies out. That's a little different, but... Was it Mord? Oh, I think Mord had it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there it is. <laughs> Not the fucking pizza fee. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Why so many spikes? Because he's cool, bro. He's like the metal guy. Yeah. Yeah, but this kind of shocked me. I was like, huh, interesting. That's just like one-to-one. -one. Scarf and everything. 
Yo. Stop league posting. I'm not. I'm Project L put. Where did Darius go? Yo. Oh, that box. Was that an echo thing? Did he phase him out of reality? Okay. That must be a glitch. Nice. Oh, he tagged out? You can tag out without, like, jumping back? Oh, good. All right. Yeah, I wish I had more insight. I don't know what I'm looking at. Now we pack the leftovers. Oh, he has a dash attack? Plate finished. The hell is that move? Now we pack the leftovers. It's a grab. Okay. Yeah. What is this meter right here? Good stuff. Why you got a lion in his health bar? There's get-up attacks in this game? <gasps> really? That's kind of cool. Was that an auto burst? Oh no, last stand ready. Oh, it's a fucking, it's uh, the fucking, uh, yeah, the rage art, right? Uh, super assist burst. Oh, that's it. Never mind. Uh, almost. All right, come in. Okay. There we go. Oh, and the picture perfect finish good stuff. It's GG's. GG's, GG's. <laughs> Sweet dreams. I hate both of these characters so much. Call me when they get a cool character. Actually, all three of these characters are some of my least favorite characters in the game. In League, I mean. Not in not in not in Project L or whatever. What did Echo do to you? Did you ever play through Tank Echo? I done a streamer, these games don't seem that forbidden sus. No, these aren't the forbidden games. You know we'll get to those later. Although this is this is forbidden for now because you can't play it. There was a time, so this motherfucker is supposed to be. At first, he was envisioned as a uh, mid lane guy, and then he became a jungler. I think my my friend is actually the number one Echo player. E Echo jungle, or he has the most games. Hold on, let me look up his account. He played a fucking lot. Hold on, let me see. Uh, he is in, he was Diamond 2, Season 1, 2023. How do I see his rank? Maybe not. He was a high rank Echo. Him and I used to duo, he'd play Echo Jungle, but, and I, and I would play mid. But no, so, so, this motherfucker is supposed to do a lot of damage... And he's supposed to be a carry. But people realized that if you just build pure tank on him, he would do so much goddamn damage and you could never kill him. And he has an ult that basically gives him half his HP back. So Tank Echo was absurd. And that's why I don't like that character. Um, this, is a, this is a pussy character who doesn't actually do anything. And every RE player, every character that plays, a, every player that plays a waifu is just a piece of shit coomer. It's just a guy that hides behind minions the whole time and wants to taunt. Usually they have the KDA skin, playing with one hand. It's disgusting. I can't stand these kind of players. Um, and then Darius is literally uninteractive. Now, now, I used to play top lane when this guy was around. I don't know how it is now. Top lane is a fucking wasteland. This guy's a top laner. Top lane is, is the most barren... Uh, lane in the game, Riot doesn't give a shit about it. They just kind of put characters out and they're like, fuck it, whatever happens up there, it's very laissez-faire. This guy is annoying because you can't really beat him 1v1 with most characters unless you're ranged. And that's how it used to be. I don't know how it is. He was the Kazuya of the game. It's like you can't fight him. You, you literally stay away and then he gets bad. You, you cannot fight him at all. You just leave him alone and then he doesn't do anything. Pretty much the same. Okay. Bad player take? I don't know what... I, when I was top lane, I was my highest deal. I was good. <laughs> what are you talking about? I knew what I'm talking about. I don't know how it is now, though. It, it, it may have changed a lot. Someone convinced me not to reinstall League right now. I, I can't. You're going to have to have that battle with yourself. Go deep down. The arena mode is fun, dude. Oh. Uh, Wait, where, was that the end of the match? Did we see the end? 
Because that was the thing. Yeah, that was it. Okay. GG's, GG's. They said Alawi was in the game, right? <laughs> Sweet dreams. Yeah, okay. And Jinx? Yeah, powder. Bat chest. Cool. So what's duo play? Hey, Is that just the 2v2 it's thing? Our favorite time of year. So we thought we'd check in and let y'all know what's happening with Project Dell. From the start of this project, we felt that if we were going to make a fighting game, we needed to bring something new to the genre. Uh -huh. We're investing in some big ideas that we hope will unlock new kinds of fun for fighting game How fans. big? I'm happy to introduce one of those big bats for you today, which some of you have already suspected. Project Dell isn't just a tag-based fighting game. It's a 2v2 team-based fighting game. This means that teams of two players can face off together in the same match with each player piloting a single champion. Yeah, so that's just explaining. Got it, yeah. So we're building yeah. a game where you can play to explain how it works. Yeah. Damn, that hurts. Maybe I just handshake and you jump up after? Yeah, yeah, I could do that. Okay. Hit the spin. All right, it's gonna be cheap, are you ready? Oh, you like- There's no traditional fighter that does this, right? <laughs> Not that I, no, I mean, like, clean, chat was saying you know? that you do love Dragon Ball is 3v3 or Y'all have no idea doesn't. how long I've been waiting to talk about this. This is Clock, one of our game designers. Yo, what's up, everyone? Let's get into Street it. Street Fighter X Tekken Dual tried. play works a bit like tag team wrestling. That's the thing is a lot of, like, game concepts and ideas have been tried before, but they don't land. Like, Multiverses was a neat idea, um, but a lot of people just wanted 1v1, and that game was not a 1v1 game. Like... It was so bad in 1v1, but it was very funny. <laughs> One player controls the champ on stage, and the other waits off screen for their teammate to find the right moment to tag them in. It was fun. In 1v1s update, were not fun. We showcase some of our tag mechanics. Not at high level. All of They're just fucking dodging the through everything. Fighting a shaggy up. was one of the most agonizing experiences of my life. Sharing in victories, defeats, performing combos together, or saving your partner in a clutch moment are just some of the new ways you can experience the game as a duo. Shaggy just kicking over and over Project and dodging through. Project will support 1v1, 2v2, and even 2v1 matchups. So don't worry, solo players. You can still play as a solo tag team fighter and control both champs at once. 2v1 is kind of cool, but can you, like, can you solo into another guy? Would you ever want to do that? <laughs> Like, matchmake with another person? That sounds pretty bad, actually. Fight your own battles or bring a friend. The choice is yours. Time to throw down. I, th I don't think anybody would ever want to do that, actually. <laughs> the one has the advantage every time. Whatever your setup, yeah. our systems are designed to feel fluid and rewarding for players on stage and off screen. And that Spam missing ping on drop combos? Yeah, my ass is turning the pings off. Pings, emotes, any kind of communication, I'm turning that off. However, I will say, the arena mode, people are nice in that. People are very nice in the arena mode. People are not toxic. I've fucked up so many times in arena, and people are like, nice try. I'm like, damn, okay, thanks. That starts before you even get into a match. It's my turn. I want to play. Let me in. Before the game starts, each team can choose to customize how their champs play together. The only thing that I've seen in arena mode are people bitching about the characters that you pick. Because I pick a lot of Shaco, and people are bitching about it in all chat and crying. And I'm like, dude, just... W who cares? It's the for fun mode. You're a bastard? Shaco's fun, dude. <laughs> Ban him. There, of course you pick Shaco. Shaco's fucking fun! I finally get to play him in a mode where he's good. And not have to wait 45 minutes. Stupid. Something we're calling the Fuse System. Me saying it's fun when I pick Alistar. Yep, he's my second most picked. Alistar, Shaco, and Twisted Fate AD. That's it. With fuses, every time you can choose between powerful synergies Love that them. change up your duo's playstyle and really allow player expression to shine. I want to talk about one fuse called 2x Assist. This allows your team to throw out two assists back to back instead of just one. With each champion having two assists and some of them being chargeable, there is a lot to discover. Oh, that shit like perks. But you can always change your fuse for the next match to find out what feels right. Who's the cute girl on the Yeti? Wait, like in the game? You mean you didn't see it here, right? That's Nunu, and that's a boy. We're really excited for all the possibilities <laughs> here and can't wait to see what you come up with. Team play is at the heart of Project Dell's design and the foundation. Bottom left? Use for the next map. Wait, is there? And some of them being there chargeable. Nunu here? There is a lot. One. With the that's not. I don't know who that is. That's not a person. He's not in the game. Each champion having to assist in. Your ad space. What? Oh. Oh. 
some of them being chargeable. That's there not is Zillion. Shut up. Lot to discover. He doesn't have his big ass clock. Wait, is that Zillion? To find out what he doesn't have his big ass clock. Feels right. We're really excited for all the possibilities here and can't wait to see what you come up with. <laughs> Team play is at the heart of Project Dell's design and the foundation of the game overall. We know it's a difficult design just challenge an to get Ionian, right, yeah. but we spent a lot. I think Ionia is like, like, never mind. A lot of time figuring out how to make dual play something truly unique and special for you all to enjoy and master. Place Japan. Yes, it's Japan. Okay. I was I didn't want to say it because I didn't want people to be mad at me. It's, it's just Asia in general. Ionia is just Asia. I'm yeah. sure you've got loads of indistinct Asian region. Yeah. <laughs> so keep them close because I have one more thing to tell you all. Okay. I'm thrilled to say that Project L will have a playable demo at Evo. That did get announced, yeah. But you okay. can come try out the game on the show floor. We'll have four champions available. No sign-up required. That shit's gonna be long. You know how long that's gonna be? That line, dude? Man, are you going? I don't know. <laughs> I still don't know. I don't know if I'm going to Evo. Just stream it? I might. I might just restream it. I don't know how it's going to go. Too late now? That's not true. I just want to be in the arena, right? That sounds so cool. Didn't get the callback? No. Apparently the uh, the the actual, like, you know, opportunity to cast Street Fighter was very, very difficult to get into. The, the talent pool is massive, which is great. That's that's good. I think that's fine. You don't have a Sunday ticket? Do you have priority or something? I, I could probably talk to friends to... So at the old Evos, there was a skybox that the casters and stuff could go into that's like up at the top. I could probably work something out. Because I actually did get approved for media coverage. Nepotism. Kind of, yeah. There's standing room. Um... Maybe. But I did get approved for media coverage, so I do have a badge. So, I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, media coverage. W. <laughs> Dude, I can't believe they keep skipping the intro thing. Where they're coming out. I hate that shit. Just let it rock, man. I think they keep forgetting, though. Drives me insane. Yeah, man. Like, whatever. I might restream it. I might end up going. I don't know. I'm I'm still working on it, and we're like a week away. Oh my god, we're like a week away. Fuck, man. Oh. They'll let it rock during top eight. Yeah, but somebody has to remind them. That's the thing. They're just gonna start mashing it. You can't compete, right? I mean, I I don't think I I don't think I was allowed. But even if I could, I wouldn't. I'd rather just not. I'd rather just explore. Honestly, I, if I was a player at that level, I'd probably just mash the button anyway. I do that all the time. I'll be playing somebody in Street Fighter Six. I'll be like, damn, this connection is awful. I'm never rematching this guy. And then after I win or lose, I just mash X. <laughs> oh, no. And I'm just, I'm so annoyed because I'm locked back in. And, of course, they want to rematch. It was fine on my end. Felt good to me. And then we just play again. So stupid. I always mash. I, I can't help myself. It's bad. Did you get a fight stick? Yeah, but I don't use it. I haven't been able to devote the time to it because I devoted so much time to Pikmin 4. Speaking of, a chatter told me something. Wait. <laughs> Only one here has reviewed Pikmin 4. What do you think the score is? It's a two. <laughs> a two. Not a zero. This is a huge... Uh, this is an endorsement, honestly, from, from Grandpa Only One Here. This is big. This game is complete garbage. Greedy developers are charging $60 for an indie quality game. 
Graphics are trash, but textures are puke-worthy. Animations are laughable. Whole art style stuff is an excuse for developers to be cheap and lazy. When I pay $60, I expect top-notch AAA quality. That's what it lacks. The physics are beyond horrible. Gameplay is boring and repetitive. The story is terrible. Auto-lock is annoying. Damn, he did play the game. He knows about the auto-lock. He does play games, I think, dude. How does he know about auto-lock? That's something only an actual player would know. He's not just reading. You know what I mean? Local co-op campaign multiplayer is a joke. All the second player does is throw stuff. Are you kidding me? This is a true co-op experience. Deluxe has an actual co-op experience. I bet he rated Pikmin 3 Deluxe a zero. How greedy and lazy developers have become. I recommend that you pick this game up until it's $10. That's not happening. It's Nintendo. Although it's unlikely they'll ever drop that low. Yeah. Came with a free Pikmin steel water bottle at Walmart Online. The only thing the developers got right. Probably sold out by now, but the fact that I got a collector's edition quality item at no extra cost is biblical. <laughs> He's giving points for the water bottle? And no, CDPR. Your stupid stickers and free DLC is nothing to brag about. Why is CDPR getting shots? For what? For a steel water bottle? Dude, that's like such base level merch at any convention or event. Why is CDPR getting shot at? Give me something good like this. Seeing how Sony games are a bunch of movies, true. They need to ship their games a good quality popcorn and a two liter soda at no extra cost. Fucking got them. That's the least they could do after increasing the price of 70 for half the game. You do that, Sony, I will give you a zero guaranteed. <laughs> this is extortion. He thinks Sony's reading this shit. Sony, you, you actually give me some good games. I'll give you a one, maybe. Finally. Yeah, he's getting petty. If developers are going to release expensive garbage, at least be generous enough to give me decent physical items for free. Here's a two for the generosity. Even this game deserves a zero. So technically, it is a zero. This still is a steaming pile of garbage. But, but, yeah. we take those. It's a two. Two out of ten. <laughs> Just enough water. <laughs> a decent amount of water. Yeah. You know what's crazy? Pikmin 4, I think, is like one of the highest rated user scores of all time. If I'm not mistaken. It's like... Dude. It's like very high now. Ocarina of Time, Tony Hawk 2, Grand Theft Auto, Galaxy 1 and 2, GTA. Damn, Disco Elysium. Um, wait, is this critic? This is critical. This isn't, uh, user. Oh my god, it's number one! Is this of all time? Holy shit! Okay, well, this isn't real. <laughs> Ten hearts? Ten hearts might be good. I'm being mean. Oh, it's last 90 days? Oh, never mind. Super liminal, minimum, liminal, 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 super liminal. Yeah. All right, it's not quite. Okay, twenty three. Okay, behind Code Veronica, so this shit is fake. Okay, never mind. That shit's not real. I heard that it sold like very well though. Retail launch sales of Pikmin Four Japan are the highest in the series yet, over twice as much as the previous launch Pikmin Three, including digital launch should be at over six hundred K, which is the second best selling game. Second best. Though, I mean, it should have been the best without, like, second best in seven days. I, I mean, still, though, it should have been number one with a bullet, right? It's Pikmin, not Mario. It'll be the best-selling Pikmin of all time in, like, 10 days. I guess what I'm saying is, like, with the, with the Switch install base, this shit should have been second-best Nintendo game, I think, not of the Pikmin games. Well, they say the series' best games. Whatever. I heard that it outsold uh, Final Fantasy 16, so get fucked, Sony. <laughs> Take that, Square. Three Deluxe Lifetime is higher. I just hope we get more, and it doesn't take 10 goddamn years for it. That's all I want. 
Oh, I see. It's the series' second best-selling game after that long. I see. All it's taken is a week or whatever. Oh, wow. That's unbel... Th wow. Okay. Good. Please, God. Hey, ads in five seconds. Subscribe to the Coney stream. I've already said this like five times tonight. If you haven't done it already, then you don't even want to subscribe. You must like ads. You must like being marketed to. Well, guess what? I got great news for you. You're going to get more. Even you, big ass bed bug. <laughs> You're getting ads too. I thought I said bread bug at first. I was like, damn, that's a cool name. I love bread bugs. All right, I'll see you guys in a couple minutes. You're going to miss the Forbidden Games. I'm playing some games you were never meant to see. Games that were not supposed to ever be perceived by mortals. Happening right now. Bulborb over Redbug? I mean, I like Bulborbs better too, but I don't know if that's a popular opinion. Cue the power shutting off now. Dude, I forgot to say that. Dude, my I thought I pulled something. My power just completely shut off for an hour. Every The whole neighborhood was shut down. I thought maybe I did something wrong. <laughs> when we moved in, the previous owners told us, yeah, if you're down here and if your wife is using a hairdryer on the other end of the house, it might shut down. And I was like, what? And I thought Mal was drying her hair at 11 p.m. And I got so mad. And then I went up there and her ass was asleep. I was like, huh? Huh? So, yeah, I don't know what happened, <laughs> but everything just shut down. It's the aliens. Dude, I don't even care about the aliens. And I know that that's, like, everybody's saying that, but, like, for real, who gives a shit, man? We have so much other shit to worry about. I would have cared about aliens ten years ago. Now it's just, like, they can have the planet. Whatever, man. It'd be weirder if there weren't any. Yeah! It used to be a big deal. Streamer, I've got the titch. Is there anything you and I can bet on this evening? I mean, we could bet on these games. You're going to see uh, some forbidden games, unlike any that you've seen before. Some games that were not supposed to be played by mere mortals. But I bring them to you like Prometheus with the flame. Oh, that's a good line. i got to use that in the YouTube intro. How forbidden? So fucking forbidden. You've seen uh, glimpses of these games, but you've never had the opportunity to play them yourself. They have not existed. To <laughs> peck out his organs? Don't do that. You better not fucking do that. Y'all better not turn into crows that endlessly peck out my organs. I hate that shit. Cody, <laughs> don't play Hoonie Pop on stream. When is Ratatouille happening? I don't know. I, Whenever it happens, okay? Sometime. Alright. Rat Race is the actual forbidden game. I would like to. Alright. I would like to do it. Coney is about to play Super Seducer. You know what's funny? I played the first Super Seducer and we all had a lot of fun and we're laughing. And then I played the second Super Seducer and it was a lot of like, uh, I feel like this isn't fun anymore. <laughs> I think times changed between Super Seducer 1 and 2. I think time, like, I was like, this just kind of sucks now. Like, the, the novelty was gone. You know what I'm saying? Red Pill became too real. I think that's actually it. That's a really good point. I think it was like, wow, this is funny. Nobody would ever do this or think like this. How silly. And then by two, it was like, yeah, that's just a guy now. That's a normal guy that you can find in the world. And it's like, oh. <laughs> okay. That, I guess that's that's what made it different. Laughing at people becomes less funny when they're in on the joke. Well, I thought he was, like, being tongue-in-cheek, right? I thought he was clearly, like, winking at the camera a little. But, yeah, I, uh, this is weird. I'm not, you know, I'm not really feeling it. When did you play it on stream? Feels like forever ago. Whenever it came out. Thank you, Funky Kang. Okay. What's a good, uh... What's a good, unknowable, um, eldritch 
Cosmic Game song. Indiana Jones theme. Not what I'm going for. Mambo number five. No. <laughs> Stop that. Gigas? <laughs> oh, I kind of like that. Wait a minute. <laughs> yeah, we're talking about aliens, too. Don't play no trumpet. All right, listen. Can we meet in the middle on the trumpets? Let's meet in the middle on some trumpets. Wait, what happened with that bit, Dono? That. <laughs> he didn't say trumpet. He just said the. What happened there? What a scam. I guess you're going to have to donate again. All right, I'll meet in the middle, okay? Maybe not one million. I'll do 500K. Sound good? Shake? Because I do think a million is a little bit too cruel. All right? It should be an investment, so my streams aren't fucking hijacked. <laughs> I'll do 500. We'll, we'll see how it goes. You want to hear it? You just want to hear it maybe once a week. Yeah, like, maybe once every few days, right? Maybe that's it. Okay. But I definitely thought that was part of the song. Okay. Fellas, have you ever seen Into the Fourth Dimension? Have you ever been glancing at your phone and you saw something that you weren't meant to perceive? I have. I've seen plenty of mobile ads for games that seemingly don't exist. I've seen ads for games that I've looked for endlessly on the internet and I can't find them. The one with the, where you have to pull the pins on the guy, you have to save him and get the gold. Can't find that anywhere. Or what about the one where you have to park the car and there's a bunch of other cars in a parking lot? It's impossible to find. Well, guess what? I found the unfindable. I found a game that has compiled them all into one spot. And like Prometheus with the first flame, I now give them to you. Behold, my greatest gift. Yeah, you want those games, right? So here you go. Now, let's see you clear them. On Steam is a collection of these games on mobile. And oh my god, I was, I was unreasonably excited when I saw this. <laughs> I was actually very excited for this. This is actually made by the Katamari devs, so it's it's like good from what I hear. I tried not to spoil myself, so I haven't seen it. So let's give it a shot, shall we? I hope my 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 eyes don't melt out of my head for perceiving this game. <laughs> I've seen Raiders of the Lost Ark. I better not get in trouble. Oh, the people who did the Katamari port. Uh-oh. <laughs> That's a little different. That might be an undo. All right, let's turn this down a little bit. Oh, the ports were good? Yeah, but it's just a port. That's not a game. Oh, this shit is WarioWare, dude. Kirby-ass menu? No, that's WarioWare. What are you talking about? <laughs> this game title is stupid. Okay. Yeah, that's the WarioWare font. All right, and it says mini games. Oh, d dude, get me in pinpole. Yes. That's a lot of levels. It's there. <laughs> I found the treasure. Hold on. Maybe I go, like, up here, you think? Okay. That's probably the right play. Okay. <laughs> uh. Got it. Coney, how do we gamble on this? I don't know. You figure it out. Solved it. Three stars. <laughs> That's a lot of things. All right. I don't know if I deserved all that. If there's treasure, Stickman will find it if you remove the pin blocking the way. Okay. Be careful not to collapse from exhaustion. What do they mean by that? Uh... Okay, the rock goes first. Yeah, because then I can do this. Okay. Wait, did I not get three stars? What did I do wrong? Was it the clear time? Whatever, I'm not redoing it. This is stupid. What do you mean too slow? No, don't, don't do the dog. 
Got it! Solved! I told you I'd be good at these games! That's a three star. Solved it instant. Can you imagine getting one star on that? Okay, that one was a little... I, I feel a little... Oh, kill that dog. Jeez, I feel kind of bad for that. All right. Pull the pin, get the treasure. I, I, I'm pretty good at this now. I get it. Yeah. Why? That dog would have killed me. I don't blame you for not knowing that because you've never played a game like this before. D oh, no. Uh, here? There. Kill both those dogs. Uh, oh, no. That doesn't kill both? Okay. Jesus Christ, what a scream. Oh my god, it sounded like they actually tortured somebody in the booth. Okay, so probably like this, right? That slides. And then... Um... Like this? Am I stupid? What? What do you mean it broke? What? Why did that break? He's so dumb. What do you mean? What am I doing wrong? Wait. Gotcha. Okay, that one was a little tricky. That one was a little tricky. Now this looks like the mobile ads. Shut up. <laughs> you guys watching those ads? No, this guy sucks. I could definitely beat it better than that guy. That was stage five. That's kind of tough. My IQ is five. Who is that? Find the treasure. It's right there. <laughs> cool. Hunters will kick wolves if the pin blocking them is removed. They won't move when they kick. So use rocks to kick. Okay, so hunters are bad. Hunters kill the wolves, but they'll also kill me. Okay, sure. Um, Go... Will that not kill the dog? Yeah, I win. I don't want to interact with that guy. I was going to say, I don't have to mess with him, right? You are so bad. What are you talking? I got three stars. What do you mean I'm bad? I just won. Oh, this is hard. All right. Uh, he, he interacts with the dog. Kill the dog. Yup. And then we kill him. Or he'll kick me. Yup. And we lock it in. I'll pull another pin just for fun. Dog's dead and I get the treasure. Is that the Mario Baseball font? I guess it's the same as WarioWare. Find the tre Okay, this is... We're getting really complicated here. Will this kill the dog? Surely it will. Right on his head. Perfect. All right. Oh, no. Wait. <laughs> well, he won't kill me, though. Outrun him. Run! Go to the treasure! Go! Oh my god, right in the shin. Okay, that was a tricky one. That one was a little tricky. Ooh. Okay, I see it now, though. Yeah, go kill that dog. The blood's on his hands. What's weird is this guy doesn't even know any of this is happening. He doesn't know what's happening right below him. Two dogs and a human has died. First try, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> Why is my IQ 9? Why couldn't it go up in intervals of like not 100 or something? Okay. Uh, uh, we need the rock to kill him. So you do this first. Guy kills the dog. He can't help himself. You do that again. This guy's a fucking maniac. He kills him. Then we kill him because we're mad at him. And then you pop this. And then you pop that. And then go get the treasure. Lock it in. Coney, I'm sick of this music. Can we set up a media queue? You guys want sound uh, song requests? <laughs> I'm down for that, maybe. We're going to get to the hard part soon. New stage unlocked with your accumulated IQ. <laughs> Not only am I unlocking new games with the power of my mind, but I can also unlock new stages for those games simply by thinking about them. Uh, can I just kill that goblin? Wait, how do I leave? There's no treasure anymore. Oh, I won. Okay. Stickman won't move if there's no treasure, but the enemies will. Use Stickman as bait. Okay. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Why do I get one IQ per win? I'm gonna be so smart by the end of this fucking game. Okay, so I'm bait, and then... Ah, it's a timing puzzle. Aha. Wise, wise, wise. Okay. <laughs> smart. Oh, what the fuck is this? Will that kill him? I think this just slides off and he dies. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, this this might be kind of hard, actually. Could, could he just die here if that... And then... You do this. And then he's good. No, 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 no! Oh, my God. That one's tough. This one's kind of tricky, actually. Hold on. <laughs> Guys, that one's harder than it looks, okay? That one's pretty hard. Okay, slide it. And then slide this. And... <laughs> Why did he stop? Did anyone see him stop? He stopped moving. Right? <laughs> Stupid. Am I doing this wrong? Could I just do it this way? No, okay, no, it breaks. He stopped because there was a fucking rock. Well, he doesn't know that. How could he have known that? Go, go, go. Oh, my God. I know I'm not doing this right. I know I'm not doing this right. Okay. Hold on. That. This. <laughs> okay, all right. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. This. He's dead, right? And then this, and this gives me more time to set up for that guy. No, 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 no. Look. Here we go. And got him. There. I got it. I got it. And it's three star. It just took a little bit of time. That was the hardest one so far. That was the most difficult one. But I three starred it. We figured... Oh. What do you mean? I didn't even take that long. They had to walk to... What the fuck is this contraption? How did I even get in here? Um. Gotcha. Uh. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay, I did, I did, I thought there were two things there. My bad. My bad. Hold on. Hold on. Uh. Yeah. Okay. I bet. Oh yeah. This is. This will do it. Here we go. Here they come. Um. Two. Why did the other guy not walk? That should have worked, right? You know what I'm saying? That should have worked. <laughs> what is he doing? My best! Hold on. I did fucking shit. The controls are really bad on this, actually. They're probably better on the phone. Coney is the ads guy. <laughs> It's harder than it looks. Don't the ads say that, too? All right. Um. Oh, this is it. Here we go. Wait, there are two? No, 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 no. Go. No, 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 no. I want to keep playing. D okay. There wasn't an option to stop. I didn't know. I, did, I thought it was going to miss him. I didn't think it would hit him. Whatever. Three stars. Hit my feet. Two stars is fine. That's fine. As long as I get the IQ. Level 15. Yep. Lock it in. Who is that? <laughs> what does he do? Okay. The same thing as the other guy. Do they fight? Why are there two of them? Why did they make another one? Okay. Do I go to 20? I think we go to 20, and then I could try out a different one, right? All right. Uh, we do...
I'm not gonna one star. I'm thinking. Hold on. You go. Um, this. He kills that guy. Then you go this. Go kill that guy. This is a bait. Gotcha. I don't need to leave. Yeah, I don't even leave this area. What do you mean, cheater? It's an IQ game. I have to think. That's the point. What? Honey, turn on the songs quick. Chat oh, sure. Becoming frenzied All right, bonkers. you got it. You got it. I'll put on. I'll put on songs in a second. Just let me. I'm thinking hard. Can he kill both of them? That sound. Oh my god, it's brutal. Rock, kill him. <laughs> okay, I didn't think that would work. I didn't actually think that was gonna work. I was I was kidding on that. Yes, kissing toads is banned. You knew that already. You just wanted some. Oh, is that a ladybug? I got a ladybug in my room. That's good luck, guys. Man, that'd be so lucky if somebody dropped a hundred subs right now because that ladybug was in my room. They're good omens. Did you know that? Yeah. If somebody drops a hundred subs right now, it's because of that ladybug. Wouldn't that be so cool? <laughs> That'd be so, so nice, right? Probably a pumpkin beetle. What the fuck is a pumpkin beetle? I've never heard of that. Oh, Never mind, that's cute. I like that. I've never seen one of those. I like that guy. Beetle stun lock. It's one image. <laughs> I looked at one picture. You guys are so quick to call anything a stun lock. If I ever use Google, it's a stun lock. Instantly. Okay, hold on. I'm turning on the song requests. Just make it good, okay? All right, I'm clearing the music. Wait. Three, two, one. It's clear. All right, go now. Go. Go, 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 go. Immediately, Pikmin 2 OST. What? Wait, that wasn't what it was. Wait, the cue was wrong. Was it this? Was this the first song? Or was it this one? Okay, this was from Only Up. <laughs> I think this is from Only Up. There already was a cue? No, I wiped it. I threw it away. Okay. Wipe it again? <laughs> no, no. I think it's this. I think we're good. All right. Wait, what's the gotcha? Gotcha! Spin it! I got... Dumpling. I think this is only up music. <laughs> this shit is annoying. Surely you did not ask for this. Bot is dead? You guys killed it. I didn't do anything. I think the bot broke. Well, you shouldn't have asked it for so much so quickly. You did that. This is the bread bug song? This is so ominous. <laughs> Never mind, that saxophone is funny. That saxophone, it goes a little foolish. Why do I have a title plate in a single player game? Cool. <laughs> awesome. Okay. Let's try something else, like number tower. Wait, how is number tower hard? Oh, thank God I can skip. My IQ is enough that I don't have to waste my time with bullshit. Okay. 10. Uh, you go times 2. That makes 20. And then you can go times two again and go to 40, right? And you could kill both of these guys. Right? Yeah, and then you move on. What do you mean already lost? I did... Wait, did I lose? What did I do wrong? Oh. <laughs> oh. Now... Wait! 
Wait, wait, I don't... I don't think I did act... Shoot, oh, thank you, kid. Wait, why did the game tell me to click on that? I lo... The game said to click on that, and it was wrong. I see now. Okay. What do you mean, dumbass? This is the first time anybody's ever played these games. That's like the whole point. These aren't real games. My IQ is too high. Immediately screws the pooch. Screws the pooch? Can you not use that kind of language in my stream? This is a family-friendly atmosphere. Messed up again! What do you mean? What did I do wrong? Did I screw the pooch? Oh, I see. I see. I see. The pooch was screwed. I see. My bad. Sorry, I didn't know I had so many uh, illegal gamers in chat that have done this before. You know you're not supposed to play these games. You guys are going to get in trouble. 154... That's what, 80, 80, 60, 67, um, 70, 77, yeah, 77, right, 77, which is more than that, if I do, se if I, if I divide it by 2, 77, and then, yeah, I got it, no, 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 I got it. We're good. We're good. Guys, it's a new game. Okay? We're all learning. This is a brand new experience for everyone. Why would you divide by two? Because you have to. You have to pick all of them to defeat the tower. Wait, you still get stuck. I didn't realize that I was on a time limit to get stars. My bad. <laughs> oh my god. I forgot about the star thing. Whoops. Alright, whatever. It, it, the, the two stars is fine. I learned how to play that. What? Uh, plus 10. Wait, did I. Should. <laughs> Times 2 is. Wait, this is easy. Yeah, this one. Yeah, that goblin's dead, dead. Okay. That one, I could have just mashed anything, right? I think I beat that no matter what. I thought this was the game music. I was like, this is weird music for the game. What? Oh, it logged me out of stream elements. Which means that song is going to play again. <laughs> Here it comes. I tried to turn on the music, turn up the music, and that happened. That's fine. It's a magical song. So, 10 beats 8, right? 10, 30, 18. If I do 18, no, I should, I should collect as much as I can, right? Yeah. 10 is more than 8. True, yeah. There, 102, and then this is the 92. And then 90... Shit. Wait, no, it doesn't matter if I... Yeah. Wait, divided by 2 is 46. So I should divide by 2 now. Yeah. What happens if I tie? Divide at the end? Why don't you divide at the beginning? Do you want to divide at the beginning? I thought you would divide at the be uh, early, right? Two star Andy over here. Shut the fuck up! These are not easy games. That's the whole point of them. Harder than you think. It says that at the bottom of the ad. These are not easy. You gotta think and like do math and shit. You know what? Maybe I'm not gifted at the math one. Let's do parking lot. Let's try parking lot, shall we? Damn. I'm all the way here in parking lot. Um. <laughs> Wait, what? What What do I... Oh, do I have to clear these out? Oh. Uh. 
What? Uh. Oh, there are walls and shit, though. Okay. Yeah. Oh, it's a traffic jam. Oh, this is kind of cool, actually. Oh, no, he's gonna hit that cart. Okay, never mind. They're nice. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Did I get in trouble for that? Am I liable for that? Okay, we did it. We got it. We did it. <laughs> did I get in trouble for that? Wait, the, the, what's happening to my frames? Wait, is that the game? Wait, what happened there? What the fuck is this? What's happening? Did that car game destroy the game? I think that car game was like mining my CPU. What the fuck is that? Dude, look at this. What is this memory? Okay, so it's working. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I want to see what happens when I do that again. Is this a Bitcoin? Hold on, I'm going to do it again with window capture. Okay, let's see how it goes. <laughs> Here we go. Does this shit just chug my CPU? Alright, here we go. Let's play. <laughs> let's play it again. I am I am very curious. Is V-Sync on? I don't think so. Hold on. Off. Do I turn it on? Surely that makes it better, right? I don't remember which one is worse or better. We have venture to beat. This game is <laughs> This shit haunted. Alright, here we go. Uh send the cars. All of them. I want to see what the CPU does. No, stop! Oh my god, I killed someone. Whoops. Go. Yes. Okay. Go. 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 Stop. Why are they hitting each other? Oh, I see. Because they were hitting that. Yeah. Can I do it this way? Oh, I could just tap on the keys. Go up. How are the frames? Oh, we're good. Okay, it was a V-Sync. It was V-Sync. Right? Did it? Okay, it was V-Sync. We're good. The game was running at like 2,000 FPS. I was so confused. I don't know what happened there. I thought that was the two-star sound. I was like, wait, what the fuck is that? The fucking blast? Wait, what is this emote that everybody is telling me to add? <laughs> That's really good. That's really good. I like that. I like that a lot. <laughs> That's tremendous. Good emote, chatter. Good emote. Okay, hold on. Let's get through this. Uh... Dude, the controls are so hard for this stupid mobile game. Fuck me. I thought he was going to keep walking. I could clear this, though. If I clear out this whole thing, then I never have to do the parking one again. And we can move on from this. Get out. Get through there. I think I could sneak that car in. That would solve a lot of issues. Yes, thank you. Okay, yep, yep. Uh, um. Oh, I'm so screwed now. Oh, wait, no, this yellow one can go. Yellow, blue, blue, red. Uh, y that, wrong one. Um. Oh my god, my brain is so racked. Yep. Why am I confused? <laughs> Why am I confused in this stupid mobile game? Here we go, we got it, we got it. Everything's clearing out. Oh my god, it's so satisfying. It's like popping a pimple. 
Uh, this, this, this. I should not be crashing them, right? Do I lose points if they crash? This, that, 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 that. Go. Done. Three stars, too. Three stars. Wait, they all have to clear? <laughs> Come on, dude. Oh, I didn't even see the car. God damn it. Cool, man. <laughs> Two star Toby. It's better than one star. Oh my god, this is too much. Alright, get get Oh, there's a thing there. Whoops. Oh, if they crash, I don't lose points. Oh, what the hell? Then my ass is. This should sound kind of German, actually. Anybody notice how this should sound German? Uh, this. Send that thing through. Send that through. This. Uh, the. the this. This. The. Uh, dude, I hate these guys. How big is his hitbox? Dude, as wide as hell. Uh, that should not be so fucking... This is actually making me mad now. Because it's just noise and colors. I, do, I can't tell where anything goes. Okay. Goes here. That's not going to work. Uh, okay. I'm, I'm, I, I don't like this anymore. I'm not having fun. It's just so many things that... To, it's too much, man. Uh, here. There. I kind of get it now. These games look fun, but when you play them, they're... Okay, this, 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 that, that, duh, uh, <laughs> Okay. It's all working out. It's all working out. The crashing cars gives me anxiety? I don't care. Nobody's pe penalizing me for it, which means it's okay. They're fine with it. I don't lose anything, which is weird, right? You think that they would be like mad at that? Move that one red car. Thanks. Very helpful. That must be a dev. Thank you, friendly dev in the chat. This song is pissing me off, and I don't know why. I think it's because it sounds so hopeful. It sounds like it's absolutely sure that I will complete this challenge. And I don't like that assumption. Okay, through here, through here. Oh, we're clearing it out. Why is that one hit it? Whatever, it doesn't matter. Uh, we go... Um... I'm getting one star, dude. <laughs> I'm actually gonna one star this. Uh... The... Th this? Yes, yes. Got it? No. Oh my god. Go, 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 uh, go, go. This is gonna feel so satisfying when I'm done, though. Like, seriously, this is gonna feel so- No! Why can't I kill one guy? He didn't even get hurt, dude! It's one fucking guy! There are three of them! It takes, like, 15 minutes! Oh my god, seeing them all come back is such despair. Seeing all of them in the same spot where they just were is so bad, man. Here, go, go, go. Is this German again? Is this the same song? Is no, this is Splatoon 2. Okay. Do they speak German? Tony, you still have task manager up. Oh, my bad. <laughs> I forgot about that. I was managing some tasks, bro. My bad. I was managing the real tasks. Trying to get these cars unlocked. Um, uh... I can't believe if I hit one guy, the game ends. That's so stupid. Can I sneak this guy in there? 
Can you change the music? No, because somebody requested this, and the, the queue is now like three hours long. <laughs> That'd be kind of messed up. The queue fills up so fast. You gotta be so ready. Even if I hate the song, I can't skip it. And I don't think I particularly am fond of this one, so... Uh, this, 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 this. Got it. It's weird, because, like, I... all From everything that I hear about Splatoon music, it's pretty good. Except this one. This is the one track. Now, I've never played Splatoon in my life, but apparently it's... Oh, dude. Huge breakthrough. Uh, okay. All the tracks are like this? That's not true. They have good music, I think. That's like the whole point, right? I think it's weird that I've never played Splatoon. But it really does feel, um... This is gonna sound weird from somebody that plays Smash Brothers. And Nintendo games in general. Does Splatoon feel extra childish to anybody? I don't know why. I can't get around it. It's for kids. Yeah, but, like, so is, like, most Nintendo shit, right? For some reason, Splatoon feels extra childish to me. Which doesn't seem fair, right? From the outside, I see it. I don't think that's a, it's a fair thing to say, though. You know what I mean? It's not Splatoon's fault. I think it's just because all the Nintendo games that I play, I played when I was young. So while they might have been childish, I was a child when I played them, which makes it okay now. Does that make sense? Like, it's not fair, but, like, if I never played Pikmin before, I might feel that way too, right? Now, see you in a little bit if you don't want to, if you want ads or you can't subscribe. But if you subscribe, then you won't get ads. So I think you should subscribe, which means uh, subscribing for free or tier one for $5 a month. It's not even that much. Could you do it? I bet you could. Hit the button right now to subscribe to the Coney stream. Sorry for that belabored ad read. I just, I'm very focused. I looked at chat because everyone was dancing, and I said, wow, that looks like fun. Everybody is having a great time. Wow, it's so cool that everybody in the stream is having a great time and enjoying this music. And then I killed a guy. <laughs> That's kind of how it goes on the road, too, I guess. You gotta keep your eyes on that shit all the time, which is kind of annoying. My ass wants to go to sleep, you know what I'm saying? Driving kind of boring sometimes. My god give him right to take a nap in the car if I choose. Truly a life lesson, yeah. Get through this guy. Have you guys fallen asleep at the wheel before? And be honest, there are no cops in here. I have. That shit's kind of scary. Tesla take? You guys have never done it? It's pretty bad. I, I don't ever, I don't even think I fully fall asleep. I did the thing where, like, it's a, it's a red light, but it's a particularly long one near my house, and I know how long it is. So I'll just close my eyes and just, like, vibe out, and I'll do this thing, and I can see when the, when it turns green. Except one time, I didn't, and I got beeped at. But I didn't, I didn't think I put anybody in danger. Dad nap? Is that not something that you guys do? Have you guys never done that? Didn't you have a story about this? Well, I had a story about falling asleep at work. That story was about another guy falling asleep at the wheel, because he's a, he's a dickhead. Uh, the only person I endangered was myself. Him endangering other people, that's different. That's me. All the time until someone honks me awake. You should see a doctor. Can narcoleptics drive? Are they allowed to do that? Be honest. I actually don't know. 
Probably not, right? Yes? I think this is it. Oh my god, that was so scary. With medication? What do narcoleptics take for medication? Is it just like caffeine? Is there like extra strength caffeine? Can I have some? Don't say this is it, but it literally is. Chatter, I don't normally do that. But this time it literally is. And it's plain for anyone to see. <laughs> uh, uh. The problem are the long shots, dude. Because I have to send this yellow one all the way up. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, can I even make this? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Oh my 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 god, dude! Dude. I, do I have to send it up first? No, it starts down here. Do I have to inch it up? Like, because there's got to be a certain level of distance where it can't make it, right? I'm in my gamer pose. The chair is back. I'm leaned. I'm gaming now. Uh, that. Dude, I love stock monkey sound effects. <laughs> Like that, ooh, ooh, ah, ah, love that. It's so good. Get your micro right. This is hard, dude. Can now see why traffic cops get paid so much. Uh, this, 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 yup. Yup, yup, yup. It's all coming together. Start moving that shit up now. <laughs> You think so? I think you do have to move it up faster, because if you don't, you get messed up at the end, or you have to move it, like, all the way across. And that's too hard. Is this the real song? Is this real? I can't tell if this is... Am I getting... Silvered? I can't... Yes? What do you mean, is it real? <laughs> you guys don't... Never mind. This is stupid. I can't tell if this is the real one or not. I can't tell. Because I don't... I've never heard this far into the song. You know what I mean? I don't know how far this one goes. I feel like the guy in that one troll face meme where he has the gun and he's fending off the cops. <laughs> like, is this real or not? I can't, I don't know. <laughs> it's real, I assure you. Okay, thank you, Shadow. What? You don't know that one? <laughs> it's Silver Gunner, it's Silver Gunner. <laughs> okay, streamer. Put down the gun. Go here, go here, go here. Oh, dude. It's all coming together. Yep. Oh, baby. Oh, no, I didn't move up this car. Yes, now we move it up. Wait, can I make this? Unironically, can I make this? Okay, I'm sorry. No shot? Does he literally repeat it? Dude, I don't know if that's doable. I don't know if I'm able to make that. Oh my god, look at this one. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. Why did I move this back? Fuck!
Oh my god. Can I just, like, get these guys out of the way? This is so stupid. Alright, uh... Do I go up when he's left or right? Do I go left or right here? I don't... Send it? I think I send it when he goes right. Not left. Go. <sighs> Not even fucking close. Dude. Okay, so these have to move up the whole time. These just... The wide cars have to move up the whole time. I have to focus on the yellow cars. It's a yellow car diff. Tony, what the fuck was that? It's really hard is what it is. I have to inch this shit forward. Yes, yes, yes. You are absolutely correct, Chatter. Oh, no. Okay, so the two yellow cars have to come forward. Yes. Completely understood. This song is going crazy. Okay. This should sound like it's from Conker's Bad Fur Day. Is this like the caveman song? Uh, this, 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 uh, go, go, go. Extreme G? That's a game I haven't heard of in a long time. The Discord is comparing you to Sisyphus right now. Shut up. You only know Sisyphus because of me, because I enriched your life with my teachings. No, don't go back. Don't go back. I'm sending this yellow car all the way up. They all move together. We all go together. Huh? Who's that? What's that sound? Sounds like she coughed up a hairball. Did you hear that? Colon closing parenthesis. Okay. Uh, the, the, the watch mojo voice just went... <sighs> Thank you, whoever that was. It just says Burb. Thank you, Burb, for the $30. You didn't have to do that. This run is dedicated to you. I will not kill a guy this time. Watch and be amazed. <laughs> As I defy my natural instincts. I think I got this one. Yeah, he goes left here. He goes left. He goes left. He goes left. He goes left. Oh my god! What? What does that mean? Why did he... Nothing happened? Nothing bad happened. Okay. Dude, I haven't seen that before. That was scary. Who cares? I care! Might have lowered my star rating. We only go threes here. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't want to watch kids WB. Get the bare naked ladies off kids WB. I thought Silva Gunner like did real music. <laughs> I was like, wait, why is he making parody songs of real songs for a second? I was like, what? what? <laughs> Can I make this? Thank God they clarified that. Thank God they clarified that, the fully clothed band. I don't think advertising the bare naked ladies on Kids WB was a wise business decision. Somebody received a call late into that activation. We're done. Oh, it's not three star- Whatever, I don't care. I don't care. I did it. It's over. It's over. All right, guys, don't worry. Only one more to go. <laughs> don't worry, everybody. My IQ is 24. Here we go. <laughs> this is the last one. And then I'm done with this forever. It'll be fine when it's over. So I need to push up the yellows. Push the yellows up ASAP. It is imperative. 
here. Go there. Oh, oh. Okay, yup. Yeah, yup. Just go to complete this within the next two hours. That's insulting. Do you, many, you know how many games I've beaten? I've been doing this my whole fucking life. How old are you, Chatter? Uh, we go here, there, boom, 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 boom. Send down, go up, go left. To that was right, actually. Go this way. D no, we want to push that up. Go this way, go this way, go this way. Send the yellow, got it. Send the red. I'm cleaning this shit out. Everything must go. All cars must go. Blue, red, and yellow. Every single vehicle in this godforsaken lot is getting pushed out. I actually had to mute the stream. This honking is making me feral. It, it's... You know what? I think it's because I decide when it honks. It doesn't really affect me. I'm sort of in a state of, of meditative bliss. I'm achieving enlightenment. Uh, this way, this way, this way, this way. No, I need to push the yellow up. Uh, no, no, I don't. I need to push this out to unclog, 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 unclog. Push up, unclog, push, push, go. Uh, push this, then push the yellow, then push the blue. It's so bold, but we're doing it all. We knock it all out for the three star. Send it full to- Oh my god, I just realized that these are right here. Oh shit. Yes, everything. Yes, 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 yes. Crash it. Okay. This is good. I think this crash is here. No, 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 this is fine. This is fine. This is fine, because I think if I crash this... Okay, I just wanted to see. Okay. Oh my god, I just realized these have to go all the way over. But they're reds, they're reds. Reds are fine, reds are fine. It's good. Hold on. Go. We're good. This one could go right up the middle. Yeah, yeah, that's easy. Oh my god, I love this track. Go. Send both. Send both. Just send them both. Okay. This part might be where it gets a little tricky. Uh-huh. I don't know if we have a prediction running, but I have a sneaking suspicion it's a believer's night. <laughs> I think we got it, bro. Yep. Send the blue. Perfect. Wait a minute. I just saw this one. Oh my god. I'll save that for the end. I didn't even see that one, dude. Okay. Okay. Go. Okay. All right. The bl the yellow can fit easy. The yellow goes straight through, right? Yellow goes straight through. It's this red and this blue that are gonna cause problems. Actually, I think the red is easy too. Red is easy. All right, last one. <laughs> Blues don't go slow. I think we got it. Star two, three star. Never have to play this stupid game again. Send the whole thing. The parking lot is crystal clear, completely empty, and in only five minutes too. Lock it in. Three star parking lot is defeated. I finished that game. It's over. Let's play cash run. Pick it up. Let's just go to the last level. Wait, how do I play? <laughs> uh, poor. Oh shit. Okay. Um, we. Uh, okay. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Oh, I should have gone there. 
Um, but... Wait, casino is at the top. Wait. Oh, casino. We go to the casino. Oh, I lost all my money. <laughs> Robbery. Oh, uh, work. Go to work. Yep, go to work. Uh, take the vaccine. I'm rich now, and now we're gonna study for more money. I'm now a celebrity. Uh, take another vaccine, I guess. That's probably good. Uh, d d uh, we'll go back to work. Lock it in. I'm gorgeous. Did it. Cash runs over. I have so much money. I'm at the top. Right? Should I have gambled? That has to be final level. Done. And I got all the ladies. Mansion in the sky. You know, you could learn a life lesson from that game. Look at all the honeys I got with me. Oh, is that my ex-girlfriend there? <laughs> what do you mean I didn't get three star? What? I could have gotten three th I should have gambled. Dude, it wanted me to gamble. I really should have done that. This is kind of a fun game. All right, go to robbery. Oh, I lost all my money. Yeah, how does this work? You go... I'll go to work. Okay, so going to work is reliable money. What do you mean? 35 chance to make it big? Oh, hell yeah. I should commit more robberies. I No, I go to work here. I'll keep it. This is pretty nice. I'll do one robbery. Wait! It worked out! No! I am so rich. Double robbery? It's over, dude. Send it all the way to the top. That's a fat three star. Committed a double robbery. Nothing stuck on me. So long, honeys. Oh, never mind. I came back. There's my ex-girlfriend. I know she's mad as hell. <laughs> nope, she's so mad. I'm going to walk into my mansion with my seven wives. All right, so cash run is a little easy. That game's a little simple. Let's try Color Lab. Oh, my God. Color Lab is the final boss of the game. Jesus Christ. No, yeah, pick it up a little bit. All right, 30. Hmm. So you have to combine them so they all go into the same thing. So blue. Blue. Okay, unironically, I have downloaded this game before. <laughs> Please don't laugh at me, okay? Oh, this shit's easy. Wait. My girlfriend plays this. Yeah, me too. What? I'm done. I thought that shit was going to be hard. It's kind of satisfying, though. That's kind of fun. Coney loves the toddler game. Shut up. This is the final boss because you got to get IQ of 30. I'm not there yet. I'm simply not there. I hate pinpool. Fuck pinpool. You can do more cash run, right? Get more IQ. Probably that's it. Uh, virus? What? Okay, so the virus gives you a 100% chance to, to lose all your money. <laughs> I guess. Do the car one? I'm trying to give the, the people sensitive to honking a break. You guys heard a lot of honks. So the vaccine makes you rich. A political ass game. This game was published by Pfizer. <laughs> Wait, no, what? Dude, I'm not getting any of that money. Fuck, stop! Stop, stop. <laughs> what is this song? No! So the lava kills you in one hit. Cool, man. Great. A pool of blood? Is that what it was? Alright, take the vaccine. Yep. Gotta start all the way back at this. This sounds like a mobile game song, right? Doesn't this sound like something you would see in a YouTube ad? <laughs> this mallow theme. 
Do people like Mallow? It's weird that everybody loves Gino, but nobody gives a shit about Mallow, right? Also, what are they going to do about the Booster, who is clearly just Wario? How are they going to remake that? Oh my god, I'm rich. I don't know if I get three stars here, but it's fine. I'll take just two wives. That's more than enough for me. Am I right, fellas? <laughs> get both of them yapping? Oh my god, I actually got two. Oh, but my ex-girlfriend isn't here to see me, and I'm in a townhouse. <laughs> the trumpet channel reward <laughs> is only... <laughs> Is only can I'll be yours for the low low cost <laughs> of one thousand Coney coins <laughs> till the end of the song. Garage sale. All trumpets must go Trumpet. till the end of the song. All right. <laughs> there you go, everybody. This is Mambo number five. I gotta equalize it though. Wait, did it? The trumpet. We have one more in him at the end. Oh. Oh my God. The trumpet. Okay. All right. The fire sale is over. <laughs> That's enough trumpets. Trumpet. Stop trumpeting. <laughs> the trumpet. Uh, <laughs> trumpet. <laughs> Why was that funny, man? It don't it's okay. Alright. Trumpet. <laughs> Wait, it's backed up to hell? Wait, really? Are we just gonna be hearing this for the rest of the night? Okay, it's over. <laughs> oh, all right, yeah. <laughs> Phew. I think the our the trumpet nightmare is over. There will be no more trumpeting in the Coney chat for quite a bit. <laughs> trumpet. Okay, one more trumpet. There's one more. <laughs> it's your last trumpet. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't do that ever again. I can't promise you that. It it does feel like a once in a lifetime thing. Like I don't know if I ever want to do it again, but 72723 All right. Let's put this back. Holy shit. Yeah, I had the trumpet idea when I was driving to Kohl's the other day to return an item from Amazon. And I, I heard Mambo number five, and I was like, why does he say that? <laughs> the whole trumpet thing, right? And I thought it'd be funny. It's stupid. All right, can I finish? Oh, this is the final boss now. All right, let's do number tower. Okay, you do, you, this one's easy. Nine and then 18, right? Tony shops at Colt. No, he doesn't. I would never. It was because I was returning something from Amazon, I swear. Colt does have some great deals. When you turn something from Amazon, you can get 50% off your purchase. It's true. Oh, hold on. A mod left this at 100. <laughs> Let's turn this down a bit, huh? <laughs> the trumpet he wants the trumpet is the best Cody quote I, I remember my feeling of panic when I was playing that game what does Lou want what could Lou Bega possibly want <laughs> and it came in like a lightning bolt I know what he wants oh, that was good I demand back the trumpets. You could just do it yourself. You don't need a streamer to have the trumpets on. You could do that yourself. 
and just play it over and over. <laughs> you don't need to infect everybody else's brain. The closer it gets, the more Lou is trying to warn you. Yeah, I think he's being kind of reasonable. Okay. My ass is sorting. Oh my god, this is so good. Could this game ever be hard? Oh, wait. I got it. I got it. I got it. Shut up. Stop laughing. Shut up. You have a pitch? Hold on. Let me look. I don't want to have an emote shortage. You know what I mean? It's like overpopulation. It's a valid concern. <laughs> I'll drop a concern. I'll give you a concern. Only because I like that gif on its own. I like that one regardless of context. Okay, we go red here. Mm -hmm. Red, then purple, then we go blue, we get green in there. Oh, it's all coming together. I love colors. They're so fun. Oh, shit! Wait, no, we win this. Uh, no, put that down. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. I got it, 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 I got it. Don't worry, don't worry. Um, yeah. I feel like this shit, like, can't be hard. You know what I mean? Okay, well, I didn't get three stars, but whatever. You get it. I'm concerned about your gameplay. Shut up! This isn't easy. You gotta, like, cycle through it so fast. There's a lot of pressure. I'm also streaming. Now there's more colors. They invented dark green. You guys don't know what it's like to be me. Two-star Andy. <laughs> I'm like a gorilla living at the zoo. And you're all just banging on my cage. I'm trying to do this. I'm trying to have fun and play... Oh, wait. This is hard now. What do you mean, failed? I could have solved it. Hold on. Go. Yellow. Right. Yellow, sure, green, got it, red, sure, uh, that, oh, dude, and then blue, uh-oh, can I do this? No, oh, dear, uh, no. I can do this, I'll work my way out, yes, we're good, um, yes, stop laughing, uh, that. Boom. Got it. Excellent. Yeah, I saw an interview of, uh, Lou Bega speaking German, and it just kind of... It looked like a deep fake. It, like, completely shifted my worldview. And I found out that was his name. I was like, huh? Trolled an entire nation. I still have a headache from the cars. Got a sensitive ass brain. Three star, by the way. Don't mean to brag or anything, but you know. Why are you guys all Amari? Stop that. I don't even like that emo. I added it under duress. Oh wait, I forgot. I gotta do I gotta do the sponsor stream tonight. What? Is this game fun? Uh fun is a strong word. <laughs> I would say enjoyable. You know what I mean? I don't know if I would go so far as to say fuck. But I'd say my ass is enjoying it. Did I just do the same thing I did before? <laughs> I feel like I just did the same thing. Okay. <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. Wait, but I have to do that first, right? I have to go pink first. You have to. Right? 
Am I crazy? I'm doing the same thing again. I'm playing the same fucking thing. I'm... What am I doing wrong? Go yellow first. You can't! Look! You can't go yellow first because then you have all these pinks. I can't do that. You have to go pink first. Hold on. My dude is a bot. Shut up. No AI could ever do this. I think this is probably like one of the first things AIs could do. Hold on. Wait. Brain blast. Yes. Yes! Got it. No, I'm good. I'm good. I lock it in. Oh, it's so over. Wise streamer. Send the blue. And three stars. My ass was sorting. I'm just trying to get the 50 IQ so I can I can say that I beat the game, I think. Because 50 IQ unlocks everything, which I guess is the end. <laughs> I don't know if this game has an ending. This looks easy. Well, you should try it. That's like the whole point. They look easy, but they're actually really hard. Have you never seen the ads for these games? They're very difficult. Uh, this all just kind of stupid. No, that's yellow. No, that's yellow, actually. Uh... This. Lufia 2 so good? I've never heard of any of those games. Wait, is Lufia the one with the cat on the front? Those games are JRPGs, right? Yeah, tonight's sponsored uh, gameplay segment is for a game called The Expanse by Telltale. You guys know Telltale, right? Well, they're back with an all-new game uh, with narrative choices that can change depending on how you play the game. What will happen next? Don't stop scattering. <laughs> Look, you don't have to buy the game. I'm just going to show it to you. Come on. I thought they shut down. I did too, but I think they they have another team or something. I don't know. With funny sounds? I don't think I could do that during a uh, sponsored segment, unfortunately. I don't think so. I think we've seen everything this game has to offer. I don't know what the... You can't beat the game, right? Wait, what is this? There's more to it. Is this gonna be like... Oh, dude, I just realized Trombone Champ with the trumpets would be very funny. <laughs> that would be good. Wait, what are these? Probably once I hit a certain IQ. Right? Coney, peep this. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> this is stupid. Why? <laughs> this is so stupid. The trumpet. Yeah. I just don't know why he says it. You know what I mean? Why does he say the trumpet? All right, let's do parking lot. Let's just knock out the easy ones to get more points fast. Because then I can get to 50. Let's knock these out quickly. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> the chat is going to be nothing but hieroglyphics. Yeah. It's indiscernible to anyone not within the culture. It's madness. All right, IQ's going up. Let's get up to 50 and see if anything gets changed. Hey, Cody, it's me, your cousin. Marvin Cody, you remember that new sound you were looking for? 
A <laughs> Back to the Future reference in the Cody chat. Love that. That's great. That's fantastic. It's lost on these Zoomers, but I appreciate it. Dude, that's like a perfect movie. I watched that like a year ago with my wife. That's a good ass movie, bro. Don't bat chest. It's a good movie. That scene pisses me off. Why? What's wrong with it? Zoomers know Back to the Future? No, they fucking don't. All they know is Timothy Chalamet <laughs> and Chris Pratt and Jennifer Lawrence and Rick and Morty. Justin Roiland. That's your goat. <laughs> Jennifer Lawrence? Maybe not that. That's more of a millennial. <laughs> Maybe not. Undo Coney. Uh, man, well, that's your goat. You guys love that guy. I thought his shtick was kind of annoying, but you guys loved it. And now look what happened. See? I love Ryan Gosling. So you're falling for propaganda, see? You fell for the media tour. Isn't it weird that that Simu guy keeps catching strays? Do you guys see that? Everybody hates that fucking guy. <laughs> And all the media and press stuff I see, they just, everybody hates that dude. Simu Lu or whatever? I haven't seen Barbie yet, but. Because he's an asshole. <laughs> Again, you're falling for the promos. He's just a dick. <laughs> Alright, let me get, let me get 50 IQ and see if that unlocks the ending. That's about as far as I can go. Before we have to start looking at The Expanse by Telltale Games. Boom, 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 go. Hey, Coney, still waiting on that sailor joke, by the way. Dude, it's not good. Uh, it's not good. It's not even accurate now. I thought he said, yeah, so that was like the whole point of the joke. Do you want to know what it was? It was that, it was, I don't even want to say it. It's so embarrassing. You guys are going to say it's not funny. It's not, I don't want to tell you. I'm too scared. I'm shy. It's not funny. I just had it stuck in my head, and I wanted to wait until the bounty to keep people on. Well, it's not a bounty, so viewership doesn't matter. It's just the sponsored bit. You told the cum bleach joke. You can't be, dude, the cum bleach joke is a classic. An instant classic that will be remembered for generations. Oh, dude, actually, unironically, so Watch Mojo published the top 10 stand up specials uh, of all time, like stand up comedy specials. And I was curious, I was like, huh, I wonder what they think. Number one was Delirious by Ed Murphy. <laughs> Ed Murphy. Eddie Murphy? Have you guys ever seen that one? Because. Uh. <laughs> the way that shit starts. No. It's not a bad special, but it starts... Uh, it is... It has not aged well, let's say. I was curious one night, and I was like, wow, this is, you know, considered one of the best comedy specials of all time. It's on Netflix. Let me give it a shot. So I watched it, and in the first... The first ten minutes is literally just him going like, you know, I, I, I hate gay people. I don't mind if you're gay. Just don't do it around me. Don't hit on me. The, you gay people. It's like, oh my god, Jesus. And it goes on for like 15 minutes. <laughs> it goes on a very long time. You could be gay. Just don't be gay around me. It's like, don't, Eddie. <laughs> and I can't believe more people don't talk about that. Good joke, Coney. No, 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 no. <laughs> do not. Don't do that. Don't do that. Yeah, it goes on for a long time. It goes on for a while. Have you ever written a stand-up joke? I've got a, I've got a type five, type, uh, type ten. I think I've got a pretty good set. I just gotta do it somewhere. <laughs> All right, I hit 50 IQ and nothing changed. I think you gotta hit 100. Never mind, it's done. It's over. Stupid. What does that emote mean, Coney? What the Olimar one? I don't know. Chat wanted it. Stupid. What's this emote? 
Pony does a little dance. <laughs> okay. I mean, we already have a couple of those, but that's when I'm checking frames. That's me watching frames. I want to see if the frames are going to, you know, more dance emotes. Yeah, we have too many of those already. But that's what I do to check how the frames look. I've done that my whole life. Okay, well, this was supposed... Th I thought this might be a YouTube video, but there's no real conclusion here. <laughs> we just have to stop playing because it takes too long. So, um, maybe we'll come back to this later. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, there wasn't really enough interest on YouTube. There, It didn't... It was just a couple of mini games. It was like five games. And the video at the trumpets. <laughs> uh, yeah. There are daily rewards. All right, let's gotcha one more time. This game sounded funnier as a concept. Well, the problem is you have to keep doing new things, right? You can't just do the games. I thought there'd be more. But... YouTube will love the trumpet part. I don't think they will. <laughs> That's weird Twitch shit. That's stuff for the Twitch crowd. I don't think YouTube's into that. I don't think so. Can we play the Lou Bega horror game again? No, I already beat it. You know how it ends. But you don't know how this next game ends. Fellas, we're going to be playing The Expanse, a Telltale series. Developed by Telltale Games. If you guys haven't heard of them, where have you been all this time? Telltale is back and better than ever. They're known for making great emotional narrative games with choices. And Deck 9 make great narrative games also. Telltale and Deck 9 are working together to make The Expanse, where choices that you make matter. Almost everyone can live and nearly everyone can die. The game is being released episodically every two weeks, meaning you can make alternate decisions and see the outcome. So when you see me play, don't worry. You can make better decisions than I do. Because I can be a bit of a bonehead sometimes, right? <laughs> Let's play The Expanse by Telltale right now, shall we? What do you mean minus two? That wasn't a joke. <laughs> I didn't tell a joke. <laughs> By the way, The Expanse is out right now on Xbox, PlayStation, and PC on the Epic Game Store. Check it out. Hit exclamation point Expanse to find out more about the game and get more of that telltale narrative goodness. Let's give it a shot. So the joke, by the way, was like, never mind, I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> You're going to laugh at me. I don't want to tell you the joke. I don't want to be vulnerable. I don't trust you. I can't trust you. <laughs> Do the job of the hut impression? No, it's too late for that. I can't on a sponsored stream. They'd have to pay me more. Coney when jokes make people laugh. Not this one. I don't think this one would. It's a joke. We're supposed to laugh. No, but not at... You're supposed to laugh with me. Like all my other jokes. Where I'm really funny. Everybody says, wow, that guy's really cool. Captain of the Artemis is about to learn the consequences of failing a crew in the boat. Consequences like choices. Like choices matter. Listen, oh God! Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You know what's funny? If I don't have the game focused, it's if I focus on the game. <laughs> listen to me, damn it! But as soon as I hit this Windows key, listen to me. we're good. If I hit that Windows key, we're set. All right, hold on. Wait a minute. Let's 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 take it easy here. All right. Max frame rate, no. <laughs> How about we put that shit at 60? I think a clean 60 is good. Whenever I turn the frame rate off, bro, that shit breaks games. When you got the frame rate off in these games, oh, baby. It's over. Okay. Okay. 
Let me make sure I, I'm doing this right. Let me make sure I, I'm doing this. That's me, by the way. Trumpet! Blah. Let's continue! Yeah, 60 FPS is fine. Send his ass into space. What's the joke, Coney? I'm not gonna tell <laughs> the sailor joke ends up funny. It's not funny. I'm telling you it's not funny. I'm I it, don't celebrate. take predictions. Well, oh, I don't know if I'm allowed to have these on during. Hold on. Our last just in mission. case. I've heard that before. This is the one. By the end of the day, all of us are going to be fucking rich, but mostly... That guy is oddly me. proportioned. He's like Thanos. It's another wreck. It's not just Do more dog wreck. posting. A video of your dog the on the UN stairs Anderson is very good. Did you see the video of my dog uh, when I was on the toilet? Ago. No distress <laughs> that one's a classic, too. Those UNN pricks never come out this far unless they're carrying something special. Aren't you one of those UNN pricks? <laughs> Easy. If I'm still one of those UNN Tweet that video. pricks, no. then you're still an OPA traitor with Anderson Dawes bounty on your head. But... Yeah, The, the Expanse is apparently past. like a franchise. It's like past a series. Past. I don't know anything about it. This is new for me. Why didn't you take it? The bounty. I knew you were worth more. Anybody who could piss off someone that dangerous must be pretty. It's a hit TV valuable. show. Okay. I have not caught it, unfortunately. But. Uh. Oh, I get to be sassy here. I'll be nice. Anderson Dawes is a gangster and a killer. Cody, why did you take down the Goldfish like Olympics? I well, didn't. That should still be up. His loss is, mine. is that video gone? It should still be up. Thank you, Sentus, for the prime. I'm sure you're not having second thoughts about our deal. No, oh, come on. We're equal partners. We pay the crew, the costs, and the overhead. The rest is 50-50. You and me. <laughs> We've got a good thing going here. Nobody fucks with you, which means nobody fucks with me. Coney, this game doesn't seem and appropriate help. for you. They use foul if language. It's just this guy. It be, you've got the deal of the century. It's just this one guy. Now drink. And maybe this is start of his character arc, where he stops cursing, and he learns the value of having a clean vocabulary. Oh, my ass is not drinking. That. Well, it, it might be funny if I drink it. Oh, down the hatch. Yeah, I'm saying, or... Whatever the fuck you people say. I shouldn't have drank that. This guy's... Close enough. I'm in trouble. He probably put, like, a truth-telling serum, and I'm my ass is gonna tell the truth, and he's gonna trick me and get me to give away secrets in intel. I think the girl says bozo later, heads up. I'll have to cancel the sponsorship then. <laughs> I gotta turn that shit off. Time to rally the crew. Not on my stream. Last. I'm on my third strike on Twitch. I can't get I banned again. By briefing Khan. Yo, gameplay! Where's the jump button? <laughs> I take out my weapon. Alright, let's brief Khan. Khan, new orders from the captain. I know. He already sent me the coordinates. Oh, ads. Yeah, my bad. <laughs> I forgot All to tell him. I can't. I got the pep talk from him. What's our ETA? It depends. On what? On how long you plan to waste my time. <laughs> oh dear. That's I a, made the lackey. That was a good character reveal. The turn around. Let her have it. <laughs> Have what? I'm gonna be mean as hell. They're gonna throw me into space. Call me that again. <laughs> hell yeah! My drummer doesn't take any shit, but yours could if you want to play The Expanse on the Epic Game Store. You can make different decisions. 
Somebody blew that ship to hell and back. Glass hurt? That's what I was thinking. I this is the same devs. More information on the ocean, I'll be. Hold on, let me look at the She's cigar. Been chewing on that same cigar for weeks. Ugh. That seems unsanitary. I assume this is Khan's husband. <laughs> it's the happiest I've ever seen her. As the XO, it's my job to make sure the ship and its crew are in order. My ass is not reading this. Ship and on our scavenge missions. Uh huh. Let's go make some choices. I can't play Vine Booms during a sponsor stream. People are gonna think it's in the game. Arlen said he put all this away. What was it? Three days ago? Lazy gentleman. Crew deck. Captain's of office. Cox needs to get his beauty. So Cox is the captain. Okay. Doing absolutely nothing. What about the trumpet? You guys play the trumpet. That's set up for you. I can't play the trumpet. I don't know how. You trumpet. I used to suit up <laughs> you can do that. <laughs> That's an option too. But I've seen Arlen's and Rayan's asses enough for one lifetime. Now, I keep my back suit in my room. I can't believe we had so many trumpets tonight. Mambo number five. Okay. This is scary. Don't worry. I don't think anything bad will happen. Does this game got like monster? They said people die, right? What does that mean? Are you going to tell the sailor joke or are you going to hold it hostage? I'm not going to tell you the joke. It's not funny and you're not going to laugh. Unfortunately, that's all no. we've been returning with so far. I'm not going to do that. Tell it. I'll tell it at 3K subs. <laughs> and don't do it because you're going to be sad about it. You're going to be mad that you did that. But I've seen Arlen's and Rayan's asses enough for one lifetime. Oh, wait, I already did this, now, yeah. I keep my back so Please get someone killed. I don't want to lose my coins. Oh, I'll try. My goal is to try to get everybody dead. Because I've never done that in a game, and I'm kind of curious. I want to see... They said that your choices matter. I'll be the judge of that. That guy looks like Cox. <laughs> Virgil. But it's Virgil! Virgil. <sighs> Guys, I might not be able to kill anybody so within an hour. I'm playing for an hour. So, you might get lucky. Well, I took a course in auto dock repair during my residency. Useful for work outside the medical system. Comedy is all about confidence. I have confidence you will not laugh at my joke. So I'm not telling it. It's not funny. I'm confident about that. This looks like the kind of job that Maya would kill for. While Miss Castillo can no doubt install a new crystal, I'm afraid we'll need a new one first. I can only imagine what ancient welding equipment the captain dug this stone out of. <laughs> but we'll need a high quality gem for surgical work. Quit keep keeping the sailor joke. You're really pissing me off. <laughs> I assume you didn't come here to talk about crystals. I'm not going to tell you the stupid sailor joke. I'm never going to tell it. I'm not going to do it. This time? It's Eldorado, very stupid. The fountain of youth? Let it has go. to do with the sailor the goblin in Rusty Venus. Bucket Bay. I will never tell it. The UNN Urshanabi. Cap believes there's something valuable on board. Something special. <laughs> do we want it's to so invite bad. that kind of attention? We'll be fine. In and out. No Hell yeah. Ominous music. Let's I'm get somebody killed. Time that. for choices to matter, bro. I would laugh at the sailor joke. Well, that's one of you. There's a thousand people in here. If only one of you laughs, that's an L. When Cox recruited me, a big selling point was the med bay and the medic. 
Not something you see on most scavenging ships. So we're scavengers in space? That's the that's what we're doing. What's your excuse this time? I feel like I should have watched the show. Please? You need some aqua caca, huh? Oh, just let me go. It just fell, okay? Well, I tell you, Tinsha, you stupid prick. Quit fucking up. Oh, do I intervene here? Uh, hey, boss man, make him stop. Shut it, Okaka. Coney, if you don't tell the joke, I'm popping the trumpet. You're bluffing. You wouldn't do that. Carry on. I'm enjoying Oh, no, Rayan will remember that. See, oh, no. Agrees. Okay, okay. Hold the good brother. I bet these guys are clones. Because it's a sci fi thing. Us. Listen up. Nah, fuck that. I'm tired of rooting around in the dumpster for that Inya. Cox promised us a real payday. He said, give me three months and you never have to work again. He said, he said, this is the next job. And he, the boss man. <sighs> Just like series. Bossing everyone around, only this time no dolls to keep you on the leash, yeah? Just tuned in. This game is about sailors. Oh, punch his ass. Uh, I'm getting them both to hate this me. This isn't serious. <laughs> On the ship, I'm the asshole. Oh my god. Holy shit, dude. You, I, let me adjust that real quick. Whoever works at Telltale that's reviewing this VOD is going to jump out of their fucking seat. I wish I timed it better. You almost had it, yeah. <laughs> Holy. Come on, Baratna. <laughs> they weren't bluffing. It's 500k, bro. Make it louder. Nope. It's got to you got to it's it's loud enough, okay? I'll just say that. You shouldn't so take far. over the whole None stream the and kill anybody in a car. That's killed. my job. That's what I do. Arlen is right. That Rayan can't keep his shit from breaking. It only makes my job harder. <laughs> ETA, five minutes, drummer. Will do, boss man. Headed back to my room to suit up now. Let's go suit up. We're about to get there, and it's time for shit to go down. And for some hard choices to be made. I got a lot closer to a captain's chair than I would have expected. And a lot further away from anything else. Oh, we got regrets. Where are you going to go, Kamina? Huh? Anywhere but here. With anyone but you. <laughs> it's time to Hate venture out into the are. expanse. Engage. You are many teams, <laughs> Belta Loader, but you are not a traitor. You love your belt, and right now, belt is me. The Expanse was such a good show, I've never seen it. But I'm learning about the lore and the characters right now through Telltale's The Expanse. You guys already know Telltale's are the kings of narrative games. They're finally back, and this time, they're collaborating with a team. Another team, Deck Nine, who make great narrative games themselves. And that's why The Expanse... A Telltale series is a campaign that's being released episodically every two weeks. Check it out. We're about to push off. Available on Epic Game Store now. Fucking make me. Uh oh. A Martian? Typical Martian, with the mouth that only knows. She a, a alien? Oh yeah, let's fight. I already beat Arlen's ass today. I guess Virgil can handle one more patient. <laughs> I want to be really bad at fighting. Can I not? Can I not engage? <laughs> My character just talks a lot of shit, but can't back it up. It's a choice. <laughs> I should put you in the break for this. You'd have to catch me first. I, I simply can't. She's too powerful. <laughs> Cutting thrust. The 
Float? <laughs> Come on. Let me hear it. Uh you got me. Okay. <laughs> Fuck yes. Finally. <laughs> Why is this in slow mo? Cuz we're in space. <laughs> we're going slower. Oh, she won one. That was a good move. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we do that a lot. Kind of a cheap shot, though. If it was a cheap shot, I would have smashed your brittle belter bones against the ceiling. <laughs> so are we like together? I you in the Martian Navy. My bones are just as strong as yours. I didn't believe a single thing they taught me at that fascist brainwash factory. Did anybody watch the show? <laughs> That's why I'm here with you, brittle bitches. Are we just flirting? We're just flirting. Arlen and Rayan have begun breaching the airlock off the bridge. Once we're in, oh, somebody's we're gonna fly into shit. space here. Io. Is this area way louder? Usually, Io is covered <laughs> up by these dust streams that fire off from its poles after volcanic activity. They turn this shit up. But it's clear as day. Oh, it's Io. It looks like any other moon. Pale and lumpy. Don't you talk about her like that. She's a beautiful volcanic goddess. <laughs> I usually only look for what could kill me out here. So... But it's nice getting to it's see... It's a very interesting eyes. show of political intrigue and hard sci-fi elements. Even if they're what the I'm eyes wondering of is, 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 are these the same characters on the ball. show? Or is the, like, is the expanse drive your ass the character? The you know what right. I mean? It, are are these is the are these new characters for the game? Drummer is okay. Let's I was gonna say because like if it's Just remember to new characters for the game, then they could die, right? But if they were from the show, it would be hard to kill them off unless it's like a different you know timeline or whatever. Drummer won't die. Okay. <laughs> Great show, by the way. I had never heard As of it before. I was saying, this. remember to keep your weight back when you're Latin. Still, not bad for an inner who's barely been in the belt for a month, eh? Reminds me when Rayana and I were learning to spacewalk. One time, he crashed right into the hole and shit his vac suit. <laughs> <laughs> shut it, Goya! Whoa. Uh, Somebody's hey, gotta die. Soon, open, right? uh, good. Let's see what we have in here. We can't. That was a good one, though. He got his ass. Does it go all dead space? Do we... Do we? Is there uh, monsters? I bet there's monsters in here, bro. I bet this shit actually scary. <sighs> Vampires? Space vampires? Yeah. <laughs> uh, fucking table scraps. Ah! Fuck! What? Oh my god! <laughs> She's crazy. Yeah. Just breathe. Keep your head down. It's okay. <laughs> that would be the perfect suit, time okay? for a trumpet. No, it you wouldn't. Won't choke to death on your own sick. Well, if I can't die, right? Because I'm in the show. Is it like a monster or like a serial killer? Because that looks uh, calculated and surgical. 
I think we need Enough. a joke to lighten the mood. Whoever put out this welcome gift for us is long gone. All you maker jokes. And they left behind a big ass ship that must have some valuables still on it. So get scavenging. <laughs> you all have your orders. Hurry up and do your job so we can get back home. <laughs> Sailor joke would be quite fitting. Shut the fuck up. Is it like space pirates or look at all those heads? If I stare at these too long, I might be the one throwing up in my suit. Uh, uh, oh. How do I get up there? Oh, shit! Oh my god, you can walk on the walls because I'm in space. Neat. That's kind of cool. Pirates like the ones who sail on the sea. No, these are space pirates. It's not the same. This shit gonna make me Fuel, dizzy. Oxygen, scrap metal, wiring. If we can use it or sell it, it goes in here. I wonder if I need all this for like evidence, you know? Lift off. Yo, lift off. Whoosh! My ass is flying. Telltale is breaking new ground with this. Oh, I'm gonna get people dizzy. <laughs> How did they make this shit? Blowtorch it. Uh. Did I do it? Uh. This looks like a fabricator of some kind. Maybe for material printing? Oh. Do we? <gasps> yes! Gimme, gimme! Open the door. Motion sickness. I'm actually getting kind of sick and I'm playing. <laughs> okay. My shit is. Time to scavenge. Drummer, looks like the officer's section is still intact. Go check it out. On it. I you thought know people the military. were gonna die. The brass always hoards the best shit. <laughs> Let's hope so. Is that a water cycler? Pick it up. Hmm. Clean palladium in this recycle. More water for me. Good call, drummer. UNN officers always keep a backup water. <laughs> what are you saying? Stop. Stop. It's not happening. Selfish UN and the country princess. Wait, let's, figure, let's see what themselves. happened here. This guy left a recording. Every army in history has been the same way. A lucky few call the shots and reap the rewards. Stop talking, Cox. Why is he making that face? Stop it, Cox. This is Private Takabe. Okay. This map would be helpful long. if all the pieces were still together. No such luck. <laughs> I thought I was going to jump on him. All right, Everything lay on the ground. The lidar, except for one gap in the captain's quarters. I'll check it out when I get in there. I want to talk. I want to hear what this guy said. Commander, okay. This is Private Takabe. The pirates have asked me to report the following. Oh, they are pirates. Members, except for those barricaded in the officers' quarters, have been killed or captured. The pirates do not wish to kill anyone else. If you open the gate now and allow them to complete their search, no more lives will be lost. And if you do not comply, oh God. So, about that. It's a fingerprint lock. You're going to need to find the right hand. An officer. Sabaka. Good news. The logs show that there was one out in the crew mess hall. Second Corporal Horowitz. <laughs> All right. Might be difficult to get his body back to the door, though. Don't need all of him. We're going to do the, oh, the hand God. cut off bit. Okay. I like it when games do this. I don't know why. Oh, what, what does Virgil think? Not a lot of particulates in the air filter. Virgil, how long do you think the bodies have been like this? A couple of days? That's my assumption after analyzing the footage of the head and the remnants of the precipitating battle. I'm not going to tell you the joke. What can you tell me Maybe about Maybe at the some heads? point. 
medically. Maybe in a very a long time. Way long off. clear they were done post-mortem. Very difficult to be precise if the victim is fighting back. I'm just gonna drop it in like three years, apropos of nothing. In 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 three years, I'm gonna drop a sailor joke Last and nobody is gonna remember this. Maya had to spend half the day cleaning out the air filter. Does Mal know the joke? No. She knows nothing about Banjo Kazooie or Rusty Bucket Bay at all. Oh, I'm hearing that joke. Yeah, are you? You're gonna be around in three fucking years to the day. I'm gonna take a note in three years to the day. On July 27th, 2026. I'm dropping it. I don't believe there even is a joke. Well, you stick around for the next 1,000 days and you might hear it. Oh, cool. You can, like, bump the bodies. Neat. I wonder what happens if I just drift off into space. I don't think it'll kill me. I probably can't go out that far. Make it a one million point redeem. People are sitting on like five million. <laughs> People have so many channel points. Did you hear how many trumpets went off? Europa's Bane. Anyone heard of it? It's one of Toussaint Zapata's ships. Ah, fuck. Should have known. <laughs> Who is that? Latest pirate flavor of the month. Led a mining strike on Europa. Stole a few ships. Now self-employed as a full-time murdering psychopath. UNN has been giving her a wide berth. If she wanted to take out this ship, it means she had a good reason. Or she's just a murdering psychopath. <laughs> Do you think Got the it. space pirates Thanks. say ahoy? No, I don't think that. Maya, I don't think they have I'm any the use for hall. that in the future. Time to find an officer. All I've right. linked the personnel records to your terminal. Try scanning yeah. the bodies and see if you It's can never going to be the first guy. It's probably the last guy. Unless I have to check all of them and it's the last body. Looks like the crew tried to mount a defense here. For all the good it did. Wait, a pirate! Poor people. I wonder if Toussaint was here herself. Oh, he's cool. I, I wish I had that outfit. Ship. I like the pirate's the outfit. This guy's definitely the captain. He's in the back. This is awful. Have you ever Thank seen you, Skepu. Like no. Not even on Sirius? Not even on Sirius. Uh, this guy maybe? This body? Hushang. Check the shoulders. UNN officers have those fancy bars. Ah, wise. Very wise. Uh. Uh, this guy? No. Okay. Is that a bar? I don't think so, right? Those are circles. I know pirates are vicious, no. but... No way it was the first guy, right? Okay. You hear stories. About people who spend too long off station. Go Big Pagal. I bet his ass is like Big in the ceiling Pagal? or something. My belter is. It means really fucking crazy. Where is he? Oh, found him. Okay. His ass is in the ceiling, I think. Does he have things on his shoulder? I'll scan him anyway. I'll find him. That's the one. Got him. Or Sorry about this. Do I do it? No, she doesn't. Okay. It's <laughs> gonna say, is there a mini game? Because I'm definitely gonna mess that up. Fuck, fuck, fuck! Rayan, what's happening? Ah, an accident. My leg. Finally! Uh, let's go! So Some action! Georgia accident! Keep holding. I'll be right there. Someone's gonna get hurt! 
Whatever mess he's got himself. It won't stop swearing. It's a secure. it's a dire Cannot situation. To lose it. They're in that's space it. and Man, they're scavenging and there are people ripping Brother, their heads off. This is a big deal. There. I would be cursing too. It's very oh, scary. Way. I'm gonna go save them. Let's get to the bottom of this. I'm going to go help Rayan. <laughs> oh, they have side quests now. That's kind of cool. How he gets stuck in a door? Wait, I bet I cut that shit off. Because I got the saw. My leg. Hold still. We'll see what we can do. What happened? Unexploded charge, I think. Pirates must have left it behind. Mm. Hashang, you didn't scan first. Oh. Drummer, his oh. suit is punctured and losing pressure. You it's need like to release thing. the vault and patch him now, or he could die. Okay. No, stop! Stop! Delay that! Stop! That vault has O2, fuel, <laughs> armaments. We can't afford to lose. Very them. dramatic trumpet hit for the situation. <laughs> I'm cutting it, bro. Yup. I'm not losing that vault. Not for you or anything. Send Virgil. No. That shit probably got mad treasure in it. I'm, sorry, I'm a pirate now. We're going to have to remove the leg. No, no, you're crazy. We need these supplies to survive. I wish there was another choice. We'll give him a really cool, <laughs> like, cyber <laughs> prosthetic. Lowering the oxygen intake. It's no morphine, but it'll help. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, cut that shit off. Yeah, let's go! You heard of Baraka. He's strong. Oh. He's not dead though, right? I didn't kill a guy. He's not dead. How would blood work in space? <laughs> the same as it works anywhere else. Oh, he screamed over Ray's the trumpet? Oh, was there a trumpet? He's on his way, but Rain's stable and his suit is pressurized. Your patch oh. should hold until he's back on board. Did we miss it? <laughs> you did good, Drum. Virgil's entering your sector now. That's a scam. Best thing you can do is hurry up and finish the search so we can get out of here. Make it louder? I can't. It's already loud. I can't refund. It was Dodo Brain. I can't refund a trumpet. I can make it louder for the future, though. I just did it. There you go. I made it slightly louder. Damn. What a choice we've made. And I bet that's going to come back to bite us later when we need his leg for something. Maybe he's running and he can't very fast. And a pirate catches him. And then he, and then the pirate asks him for info. And he wouldn't have caught him if he had two legs. But he did catch him. And then he's going to give me up to the pirate. And then he can't kill me because I'm on the TV show. But he'll kill uh, somebody on my team that I really like. Anything can happen in The Expanse. Did dude die? I don't think so. He didn't die, right? He's just out from shock, I think. Give him a peg leg. <laughs> Stop. He's alive. He's fine. She said he was stable. Yeah. He's fine. I'll definitely kill this next person, though. You're in. Let's see what these UNN big shots kept themselves. What's in the vault? Captain, I'm prepping Mr. Morozov for surgery. Thanks to your steady hand, the incision is well cauterized. Jeez. Uh, what's his prognosis? Will he be all right? Oh, a mouse! Minimal vacuum exposure and blood <laughs> Dude loss. Dude is standing. He's a very lucky man. Thanks, Virgil. Glad you were here. I'm gonna call Cox about this rat. Hey, Cap. You need any dead animals for your desk? 
Why the fuck would I? <laughs> Probably still has rabies. It's Mr. Cheddar. Think of it as a gift. I saw it and was reminded of how you just stand there Cheese and watch us do all the work. <laughs> Leave that thing so where it stupid. is. Or you'll be standing there watching us take off without you. Oh, is it in here? What? Paintings? Ah, I found I'm it. Snob, but I don't think most paintings are done on iron. Secret unlocked. <laughs> I love there Mr. Cheddar. <laughs> Me too. Blowtorch that shit. Light it up! What could be behind the square? It's a safe. Needs something. Hopefully no more hands. Uh I bet it's in the mouse. I've heard some earthers find it therapeutic to fly with something that reminds them of life at home. Plants, soil, search, stuffed animal carcasses. Look in the neck! Oh, never mind. I found it. This looks like it could open that safe. Mmm. There was a safe that I couldn't open. I remember that. Maybe something good on here. Or maybe a lot of dick pics. Guess we'll see. <laughs> they have those in the future? Cat. Found something that could I feel be like something. we we would progress past now. that. Fuck, that's a lot of data. <laughs> All right, load up the crew and head back. I'll see if there's any gold in this shit pile. There's gonna be a keypad only that dude's foot could open. <laughs> I think he's gonna have to run away from something, and he won't be able to because he has one leg. All right. What happens next? <laughs> Drummer? Her ass is yeah, boss man. Khan's picking up a short in the fusion coupling. She needs you to take a look. Now? Is that necessary? It is, if you want to put this wreck behind us. That Uno I'm on emote it. is so good. It really is. Alright, let's get it. Yoop! Take the ladder to the thrusters. Yoop. My ass is going to the thrusters. It's a pretty game. Do any lore masters know what planet that is? That shit looked like Jupiter. Is that true? Jupiter big as hell. That is Jupiter? That's not Earth. This is Drummer. <laughs> preparing to access the fusion coupling. <laughs> Stand by. <laughs> she smiled. What's going on on Jupiter? Maya. Uh. Maya. The volcano. Oh. You have to see this. Does that happen in Maya? space? Is everything. Yo! Something's not okay! Blast off! Sabaka! But what if I didn't? What if I didn't do that? <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, yeah, okay! <laughs> That's... It. Oh, alright, yeah! <laughs> that makes sense! That does Fuck make off. sense! That does make sense that that would happen. All right, let's complete the action. <laughs> the content, oh Holy shit! I made a narrative choice yeah. to not hit the button there. And I paid for it dearly. Yeah. 
<laughs> I do love it when a game will punish me for being an asshole. Sometimes games just won't punish you at all. Did they try to leave me in space? Oh, I bet the pirates took over. Took over the ship. Oh, I'm gonna, this I'm gonna take it to those pirates. Come in. What the fuck is going on? Someone respond. Cox. <gasps> Cox did this. Cock's always up to something. <laughs> this is the way of it. We all know that. Death is part of the pact we make when we venture into the belt. Why did he try to leave me? Why did he do Drummer that? Drummer was one tough bitch. With her past, I'm so I confused. She would survive anything. Thank you, Uwu282005. is immune to the realities of life out here. I know Kamina Drummer. And she wouldn't want us wasting our oxygen on more. Uh-oh. She'd tell us to get off our asses and get to work. That's the drummer I know. So long, Cox. She'd be looking ahead to God the next God, his score. ass. God, next God, arm. trolling. That's right, boss, man. I keep my eyes forward. That makes it a lot harder to watch my back. It's over. You're fucked, Pompa. How the hell did you- Sabakawala tried to torch me. Lured me down to the thrusters, hit the engine. Play it off like it was an accident. I bet he was up in the bridge alone before why, he came down here. But yeah. why did he do that? Do so we what? have a reason? New do we know that? How was I supposed to know you were on the hull? You expect this crew to believe I'm dumb enough to service the engine without any communication? Now I understand. Do y'all see what's happening? Drummer's making her move. I always wondered when she would. <laughs> Why did Virgil, you help! Was there something on that Do drive something. Can you believe this bullshit? You've been planning this since oh, you first stepped on, on the board. Damn, he has big you. teeth. Mutinous bitch. I don't care what the rest of you think. Cap tried to kill me. What's happening? Okay, so I found a drive Island on the brain. ship, and apparently he's trying Take to hide it. it. So he's. She's gonna pay for. Oh this no! This Th he's gonna remember that I cut off his leg. I had to. Do it. Don't don't do it. Maybe he right drama. You can be pretty rough on your crew sometimes. Oh, he remembers. But Belta Lorda ain't nothing if we sell each other out to Inyas. Okay, never mind. We're good. <laughs> nah. I don't think so, Pampa. Looks like they're on my Damn side skins. anyway. <laughs> I should have known. We're good. Even Everybody without the leg. Even are. when I beat the shit out Stand of the back. other guy. <laughs> this is still my ship. No, no, Pampa. No, no. Down, <laughs> We're all crew here. We may be scavengers, but we're not criminals. Virgil looks very protocol. strange to we me. We solve disputes with words, not violence. Mm. That's how we keep our Except humanity. Except for me, I'm gonna kill Cox if I get to. I I solve my disputes with violence. Give me the gun, Captain. It'll be okay. <laughs> She's gonna kill me. I yeah, I'm gonna. No one. Is gonna kill you. That's not true. I definitely won't be so sure that. about that. Yeah. Back off. I'm warning you all, Captain. It'll be okay. I'm sending his ass shit. into the vast Tell recesses it to the of space. Not me. You want to see what happens to you when they're in charge of this ship? Maybe we should tell them who you really are. Hmm? Uh. Oh no! What? Fuck! <laughs> oh no, Khan! Get his ass! Stop him! 
Oh my Not God. grandma. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Be sorry later. Right now, do your job. What happened to do no harm, asshole? Everybody on this ship is so mean. Are you okay? I'm good. Good. I'll man the bridge while you sort out this shit show. Just don't touch anything! I'll be right there! Sinister You're choosing to be dipshit. mean. Not just me, though. Everybody else is mean, too. This is a hostile environment. I did everything You're you setting cover. the culture. I could have turned you over to Dawes a hundred times, but I didn't. Because we made a deal. A deal is dead. And so are you. Oh, I'm blasting him. Yeah. Give me the choice. Give me the choice right now, Telltale. Just... Yup. No, no. Don't you fucking dare. Don't you dare- Take him to the airlock. Oh, no! No, drummer! Why am I no, doing that? If I could just, that drummer, seems kind of cruel. No. Please, drummer, no! Ah! <laughs> Take him to the airlock. <laughs> Send him into space. Listen, come on. He jacked. He's going to space right now. Ah! So long, Cox. Shouldn't have tried to cross me. Wait, so I don't get a choice here? Oh, maybe it's an intimidation thing. Listen to me, Dan. Oh, I see. Okay. Drummer, listen to me. The coordinates on that data drive. They're for the MK core. You've never heard of it. That's exactly my point. Look, you were right, okay? I did try and take you out. That actually might be a big deal. I heard deal. how you ungrateful fucks all talk about me. Why should I let you cash in now? <laughs> like MK but Ultra. Really, that's I, what I'm saying. I wanted the profits for myself. Mm, greed. Because sure. Because score drummer. This is the greatest score any scavenger has ever come across. How could you possibly know that? I've been at this a long time. When there's a treasure this big, I make it my head. business to know about it. Look, when you find what's at the other end of those coordinates, the whole system will be on your ass. You'll need me if you want any. Tony, that guy of must be it. very relatable to you, since you are also greedy. I'm a bastard, okay? I know. <laughs> Why did you type crazy. that whole thing out like a ten-year-old? Throw me in the brig. Glad I'm still here you wrote that comes. like a book report. Listen to me, <laughs> damn it. Drummer, listen to me. <laughs> Can you replay the game in peace? <laughs> Let's be nice, okay? You know what? Just for that, I'm not going to kill this guy. I think he actually made his good point. I think... Space him! <laughs> That's it. Space him. <laughs> That's really good. It's like glass him. Oh, and there he goes. He's been spaced. He got among us. Bruh. <laughs> what do bodies do? Oh, ads, ads just popped. Oh, that was a fun time for ads to pop. So now we go get the score, right? Locked. That's the play. Cox forgot to hide our drive signature. Hashang, of course he did. <laughs> oh, now shit picks up though, because everybody's trying to Captain. kill me now, right? Yeah. Captain Drummer, what are your orders? Uh. Captain Drummer, what are your orders? Uh, fly. <laughs> Damn, looks like I'm the captain of the ship now. In the Expanse, the new Telltale series by Telltale 
and uh, and Deck Nine, known for making narrative adventures. This was just chapter one, and remember, I made different choices than you can make. So if you play the game, you could try it yourself and change things up however you want. Telltale are known for making great emotionally narrative games with choices. And maybe you don't want to kill Cox. Maybe you actually let him live and put him in the break. And I bet he comes back to help you later if you're nice to him. But I wasn't nice to him because I wanted him to die. What could happen next? Well, guess what? You don't have to wait too long because you see the game is being released episodically every two weeks, meaning you can make alternate decisions and still see the outcome. Guys, check out the Expanse available right now on Xbox, PlayStation, PC, on the Epic Game Store. It's a fantastic experience, and I think you should try it yourself, especially if you're a fan of the Expanse, which I think Chet said is now on Amazon. Good show. You guys should check it out. It looks like 45% uh, snapped at Khan. <laughs> Drummer tried to get Khan to like her. 30, damn, I picked all the mean choices. Oh, no, most people punch that guy. <laughs> you know, I thought that was kind of a hard fight. I'm surprised it was that easy for people, man. I thought that was kind of difficult, actually. I don't know how they did that so quickly. So unique and quirky. Wait, you could play a prank? Drummer threatened to retaliate for Maya's prank. Drummer laughed at Maya's prank. There was a prank? Oh, my bad. I should have done all the side stuff. I didn't do the side mission where I get the water recycler. Drummer didn't talk to Khan about pirates. Drummer asked Khan about her passive pirates. Drummer did. Oh, that's probably going to be bad later. Drummer sacrificed Ryan's leg. Damn, most people didn't sacrifice, but you didn't get the vault then. How does it even progress if you don't get the vault? <laughs> most people told. Virgil, the shooting wasn't his fault. Everybody's so nice in these games, right? Come on, let's live a little. Sp stop saying spaced. The next episode needs to be downloaded. Wait, is it... Can I get it? Or is it just the one episode now? I think this game just came out. Let's see. Open store. Uh... If you pre-purchase now, you get one day early access to all episodes. So, buying it right now is the right play. And if you buy it now, you get 10% back for Epic Rewards. It's $39.99, currently available on the Epic Game Store. The Expanse, a Telltale series, available now on Epic Game Store and the other stuff as well. And I think it's only episode one. Yeah, because it got released on the 27th, which is... Today! Well, yesterday, when I started streaming. Crazy. So check back in two weeks, and there's going to be more on The Expanse. You're going to be able to see episode two, because we finished episode one, but there's so much left to do. We got different saves, so you could actually do different things. I only found four. I only found four of the collectibles, bro. I miss so much. Man, maybe you guys could do better than me, but I doubt it. Choices how to play Telltale account. Okay. I have two weeks short-term memory loss. Well, don't worry. I bet they're going to have something. They're probably going to have something that's like, you know, last time on this thing. They're going to show more. I'll be on Chapter 2 in just two weeks on a routine scavenging mission. An unexpected discovery brings new threats to the Artemis crew. Then an tapped the drummer faces relentless pirates and dwindling supplies when pursuing a new objective. What could happen next on The Expanse? Episode summary? Wait, is this like a... Like, do you... I was gonna say, do you play with this? No, okay. Damn, I missed a lot of logs. Whoops, my bad. I did not promise to tell the sailor joke. I wouldn't have done that. <laughs> you know I didn't do that. Come on. Uh, hold on. Okay. You did, I remember. You said a 2,900 subs. I definitely didn't say that. You literally did, though. No, I didn't. I don't think I did. 
Don't space me. You can't. Why couldn't the sailor play cards? The captain was standing on the deck. Oh, that was it. That was the... Guys, that was my joke. Poopa dude told the joke. That was it. That was the joke. <laughs> that was it right there. That was what I was going to say. I didn't think you guys would laugh, but I'm glad that you guys appreciated it. What are the gameplay options? Okay. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at every little thing I can because I beat the game kind of fast, but it's an hour-long sponsored bit. So, <laughs> but hey, guys, I'm a big Telltale fan. I know that you guys are too, okay? We all loved The Walking Dead, The Wolf Among Us, and so many more titles by them. I know a lot of people that like Batman, right? Fun game, fun series. They did Game of Thrones too. They do a great job with licensed IPs. And if you like The Expanse, you should check out The Expanse too. Hit exclamation point Expanse in chat to check out more from Telltale. We're back with Deck Nine making a great narrative experience that releases once every two weeks. Kara Gee reprises her role as Kamina Drummer and explores the dangerous and uncharted edge of the belt aboard the Artemis. From scavenging wicked ships in a zero-G environment to surviving a mutiny to combat combating fearsome pirates, you make the difficult choices and reveal Kamina Drummer's resolve in this latest Telltale adventure. Thank you guys so much for checking out this sponsor business stream. Alright, no, you guys are right. I, I, I did say... That I would say the sailor joke. You're right. So what I was going to say is with the Rusty Bucket Bay Sailor Goblin, I was going to have three things. And the way that it was going to be set up were like three guys are all talking to each other. And what they do 